Put the volume back. All right. Cool. Game has been open this entire time. Um. What was I doing again? Right. I had... There's so many crows. What are these crows doing here? This can't be good. I'd best hurry. This is the Rosemary now, I know. There's no doubt. I don't know what to make of last night's Ros uh, Rosemary now, though. Okay, I guess these ones are harmless. Do I? This thing's so pretty that I can't even read it. Left, right, Primmeldorf, up, Kieferberg Peaks. Never did talk to these. What about you? Seen any witches around here? Watching Somali over uh, passersby, the Lord's image rests. Eternalized in this wayside shrine. Oh. Wait. Gretel. Oh, there you are. Lepkuhen asked me to warn you two. What happened, Granny Gretel? Oh, poor Apfel struck, struck a dreadful fever. Lepkuhen and Lisbeth were up all night looking after him. Is he alright? Seems so, but after that high of a fever, I wouldn't want him frolicking about too much. Where is he now, Granny Gretel? In church, I believe. Lebkuhan said Father Hans intends to keep watch over him today. Father Hans? Oh, it's one thing after another here in Kieferberg, isn't it? Can I still, like, go into the shop? Uh, game? Alright. Sure. Oh, okay, there we go. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's always lovely seeing you, Elisa. I don't have money. <sighs> I broke as a joke. Uh, and the game is frozen. Alright, sure. Alright, hold on. Real quick. Let me grab my phone. Alright, there we go. There we go, okay. Oh, 
What's all this? I don't think I've ever seen so many crows at once. Come, Rosa Marine. We must find out what's going on. This is... yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll be scrapping bird poop off the roofs for weeks, Elma. Oh, Elisa, would you take a look at this nonsense? These crows, I see. All of Kieferberg is thick with the filthy things. I told everyone I'd seen them yesterday, Miss Elma. They're a pest, and Lord knows where, they, where they've come from. Oh, but they're not dangerous, I'm certain. What are you saying, lass? Of course they are. Uh, no, no, I can confirm they're not. <laughs> you best talk some sense into your cousin, Elisa. She's clearly not all there, the poor lass. Alright, let's go, Rosa and Marina. Ah, yes. These smell awful. Many blemished, discolored, and twinkled apples are way to be fed to the livestock. Yeah. Between the poor livestock that. Oh guys, no wonder they're being stolen. Um also, that's actually like up now. It's coming along, I suppose. Kieferberg's maple leans clumsily to the side, still stripped of its main decorations. How can I help you, darling? I'm selling. I know I have that, uh, the leather purse, yes. Are you sure that's all? Yes. Oh, no. Never mind. <laughs> That's progression. I, I don't want to progress yet. I should have believed you last night, Lisa. I suppose. Not that it would have prevented anything, though. Oh, the dreadful things are everywhere. They've been circling the windmill all morning, you see. The lads are still up there trying to do away with them. Circling the windmill? What for? Why? To steal our grain, Elisa. Those crows, yeah, those crows are a bad omen, that's for sure. I wouldn't want to land old Yochen's notion anyway, but we should give it some thought, I'd say. Now that's a bad omen! <laughs> no use whining about it, Jacob. It's a no. But Granny... What's wrong, Miss Marlin? It's Apfel, lass. He came down with fever last night. I've heard, yes. Do you know if he's feeling better, Miss Marlin? He is. It seems the fever was gone in the morning, but... Lepkuhent said the poor lad was delirious. Oh, please let me go see him, Granny. Absolutely not, Jacob. And that's final. Where's he right now, Miss Marlin? In church, I've heard. Oh, I could go wait for him by the fountain. Wait for your father to come back, Jacob. I wouldn't want... I wouldn't want you at these birds' mercy either. But Granny, I mean, if he's gonna be waiting for his father to come back, he's gonna be waiting for a long time, because that motherfucker is gone with the milk, you know what I'm saying? This also goes for you too. Don't go near those crows, you hear? Oh, but have they hurt anyone? Lord knows they could. 
Let me go see the church. Which isn't a sentence I ever thought I'd say in my life because normally I couldn't give a fuck about churches. You know, something tells me this is my fault. <laughs> something tells me. Something tells me this is due to what at least oh wait. Okay, never mind. Yes, there is no going to church. We won't be taking the church. I'd best go lend a hand, Brunhilde. No, Guido. Please don't go. What's going on here? You don't mean to say you haven't seen them, do you? I've seen them before anyone else in Kieferberg. I I've seen them before anyone else in Kieferberg, as you know. My, you ought to know something about this then. Oh, please stop with that nonsense, Miss Wilma. Those wretched things broke into the windmill, Elisa. Hence why I best head back there. Hence why I best head back there, Brunhilde. She's pregnant, Guido. Don't let her get worked up. They broke into the windmill, Miss Mr. Guido? Stole our grain, the bastards. I must go, Brunhilde. I can't I can't stand here all day. Oh Guido, what if they attack me while you're away? You no. Know, you know crows don't attack people. Uh but let me go save. Because I feel like I'm gonna be I'm gonna be filling up the the suspicion meter. Mm -hmm. Not here. Uh, actually, I could have just. There we go. Don't know why I didn't just do that. I don't know, that windmill looks fine. Oh, there's an opening up there, actually. I'll take good care of it, father. There's nothing to see here, Elisa. You best head back to town. You were the one. You were the one who first saw these crows, weren't you, Elisa? It's not as though you folks believed me when it mattered. I've said it last night, and I'll say it again. You're hiding. It matters not, old Yosun. You must focus on the matter at hand. We all had our fill of trouble last night, didn't we? We don't need any more yelling. That's for certain. Now, they didn't steal mu that much grain, folks. How much did they steal, Mr. Gustav? About a sack in total. We got here in time to prevent the worst. Damn birds were waiting. Uh, damn birds were building a nest in the oven. We'll have to give it a good scrubbing later. Doesn't seem they're keen on attacking us, at least. We've locked it up and entrusted Eugene here with the key for now. I appreciate the trust. Of course, especially after all of yesterday's going on, goings on. Because he, because he was stolen from, or because he has no horses to steal the grain with. Who's to stand guard then? Who's to stand guard here then? Before we get into that. Bernhard, there is something I'd like to say. We're all well aware of what happened last night, however. 
We have to stick together, folks. No more... Now more than ever. You heard the man. <laughs> Kieferberg is what... Uh, is what we make of it. Don't forget that. I ought to head back to church. Is that Phil feeling better, father? That's what I'm looking into, Finn. I'd best go with Elisa. Lepkuhim will fill you up. We'll fill you in, I'm certain. I don't know if I read that correctly. Will do, Mr. Gustav. I was wondering, Elisa. Mr. Bernhardt said the crows were trying to make a nest in the oven. I suppose it's a cozy little nook. I don't see what's so... So there's an oven in the windmill, right? There's always been an oven in the windmill. Rosa Marina, what's your... The tender flesh, Elisa. Wouldn't this be a good way to prepare it? Making bread out of it, you say? Maybe you could ask about town if they let you in. That's rather risky, Rosa Marina. I suppose, but... I can't think of any other way either. Not if I... Not if I want to find him. It's worth a try, I'd say. Alright, I'll see what I can find out. Nope. Yeah, and talk to Rosa Marina. I'd say this snuck in through the roof, Gustav. When did you realize the crows in were in the windmill, Mr. Ludwig? Hamish came about to collect some flour this morning. He was the one who gave me the alert. So you've locked it up, have you? We must keep those birds out, Elisa, or they will take all our grain. You could draw them away. Are you standing here all day? You could draw them away. Maybe if you scattered some grain elsewhere, Mr. Gustav. Then the windmill could still be available, and... We thought about that, Elisa. Nobody was in favor of wasting any more grain, lass. Ah, I see. We have to keep a close eye on the windmill, Elisa. You can have a word with a word with Eugen, perhaps. No, of course. I suppose they'll be guiding it all day. I best have a word, Mister Eugen. Talk to Elizabeth in church. Okay. Um. It's nice to see you, Elisa. You've heard about Apfel, I assume. I only heard he was ill, but that's all. Oh, the poor lad. Can't bear looking at his little hands. What about them, Mr. Dorothea? It's best you hear... It's best you hear from me, Elisa. So you get the real story. You've been up all night, Elizabeth. We can tell her. Apfel is fine now, as you can see. But last night, he... He was awoken by him moaning, speaking nonsense. I... Who's been be... Who, who's been creepy? Who, who was being creepy last night? Hmm? His fever was boiling him alive. I... 
We called for Father Hans and brought him to, to church, but... Apfel had never been so ill. I thought I'd lose him. He wasn't all there either. Kept mumbling to himself and I... I don't know how, but his hands are injured. It's horrifying. They look... They, and they were so bloody. It's as if they were pecked... It's as if they were pecked at by something. I can't explain it. Please collect yourself, Miss Lisbeth. That's right, Miss Lisbeth. Take deep breaths. At first, I thought he caught the goat's sickness somehow. But it doesn't explain his hands or what happened to my goats. Oh, this is my disgrace. It's alright, Miss Lisbeth. We're all here for you. It's alright. What about the goats? It must have happened... Oh, God. It must have happened when we were praying for Apfel in church. When Miss Lisbeth went to fetch him dry clothes, she happened upon two of her goats lying on the ground. They'd bled to death. Their tongues had been ripped out and their heads were severed, too. Mm -hmm. You can rest assured we'll help you, Miss Lisbeth. I shall arrange for a doctor to come as soon as possible. What am I to do with one sick goat, father? We'll make certain you and the children don't go without, uh, don't go without, Miss Lisbeth. You're welcome to have supper with Finn and I anytime, Lisbeth. Thank you, but I don't have strength, Dorothea. Hmm. Mr. Dorothea will be looking after Abfell, Miss Lisbeth. You best go home and rest for the day. Of course, Father, thank you. Mm. Come, I'll walk with you and Apfel home. Uh, no. This is awful, Elisa. Mm. I ought to pay them a visit later. <sighs> it's one thing after another, isn't it? But first things first. I have to figure out how I'm going to get my hands on that key. Romantic date available. Oh, hell yeah. What was it mining at the viewpoint? Perfect. Let's go. Fuck everything else. Can I actually go pay out for a visit? I don't know where he lives, though. Help Guido chop up some wood, marlin with chickens. Talk to folks and investigate, right. I see everything is alright, Miss Marielle. Oh, Elise, it's so horrifying to think this would happen to Lisbeth of all people. All on her own, with two young children, too. Oh, I wouldn't know what to do with myself. I haven't seen Grune all morning. I had a word with Miss Lisbeth early this morning. Grune was in tears. I couldn't bear the sight. It seems they're going to be in class with Dorothea and Lebkuchen. I'll see what I can... Or, Lebkuchen. I'll see what I can do for them this afternoon. Even if it's just keeping them company, or entertaining Grune. Oh, I can only hope none of this misfortune gets sent my way. <laughs> well, hello there. Ah, there you are, Lisa. You seem troubled, Mr. Ludwig. All of, Kiefer All of Kieferberg's troubled, lass. Now, can you do me a favor? Bertha and I are thinking of spending a week in, Prim in Primaldorf after the festival. In Primaldorf, Mr. Ludwig? My daughter has been insisting we visit, you see. Seeing our grandchildren would be good for Bertha, too. Why don't you visit more often, Mr. Ludwig? It's such a long way to Primaldorf. 
It's really not that far away. Do me a favor, will you, Elisa? Go ask Finn if he can look after my cabbages while I'm away. Your cabbages, Mr. Ludwig? They need daily tending to, and these crows aren't helping. But tell him he can't simply beat them with a hoe, you hear? Why would you do such a thing? Young lads are lazy, that's why. Okay, um... Who was Finn again? I don't remember. Maybe he's here. Better days will come, lad. When I'm settled in Primaldorf, God willing. Don't make his decisions, Eugen. What is it, Elisa? You'd rather trust it, Mr. Eugen. I was wondering about the key. To the windmill, Mr. Eugen. Was anyone asking for it, lass? Not necessarily, Mr. Wilhelm. I'm the one who'd like to use it. Did you forget anything in there, Elisa? I was hoping to make some bread, Mr. Eugen. That can wait, Elisa. Here you go. Oh, I mean, thank you. Ah, you didn't have to, Mr. Wilhelm. I'll be on. I'll be holding on to this key until the evening, either way. Surely we wouldn't. Uh, we wouldn't folks to start wanting to make bread today, too. Oh. It's almost, it's almost all the way up. Just one more. Yep. Oh, God. Several cabbages have flourished on the field and neatly ripe enough to be picked. Oh, hi. Say, Mr. Finn, there he is. I was talking to Mr. Ludwig and... Not the cabbages. Huh? He asked you to ask me to look after his cabbages. I know all about it, lass. He's losing his mind. What? That man is obsessed with his cabbages. He's been hounding me about them since yesterday. Well, alright, but what do I tell him, Mr. Finn? I'll do it, I'll do it. Whatever it takes to stop hearing about these wretched cabbages. He'll be having nightmares about those, won't he? <laughs> we ought to have believed you last night, Elisa. That's alright, Mr. Gustav. I know it caught folks off guard. I do wonder where these crows came from, though. Ah, uh, Elisa, I was hoping to have a word about Lebkuhem. You owe that last a piece of your very soul, Elisa. What do you mean, Mr. Gustav? The poor lass stood up for you against Father Hans and old Jochen all evening. Ah, uh, yes, I know. You'd have been in for a real earful had it not been for her. Lepku has a friend to keep, Elise. Don't take her for granted. I don't, Mr. Gustav. Old Yochen, huh? He's been rather vocal about these crows, too. Everything will be fine, folks. You'll see. I should go make tea. Oh, can't Saturday come any sooner? This week has brought us nothing but trouble. These crows are all about town, too. We had to have believed you yesterday, Elisa. It doesn't matter anymore, Miss Ariane. All that's keeping me in good spirit is the festival, if I'm honest. You've heard about Apfel, Elisa. The poor boy. I'll ask Miss Elizabeth what I can do for her later. She hasn't had time to look after herself, I'd wager. Oh, I can't bring myself to smile on days like these. That reminds me, 
Hainrich spending the night out there. Because of the crows, isn't it? Together with Eugen, I heard. Poor lad hasn't had time to come to terms with what happened yesterday. Eugen will be gone by Sunday. You can mark my words. Miss Wilma. <laughs> no one here. <laughs> oh, I haven't had a proper night's sleep since Friday. Elisa here has been sleeping like an angel, I'd wager. Messing with me first thing in the morning, are you, Miss Bertha? My, there's hardly a need to threaten folks like that, Elisa. How was this a threat, Miss Elma? You can tell us, Elisa. There's no harm. Eek, don't say it. You were the only one who knew about these crows. Why is that? It's because I'm the witch. There's nothing else I can say. This is a trick, right? Saying that I'm the witch is going to be the good answer and then nothing else I can say is going to be suspicious. There's nothing else I can say. Miss Bertha's taking a liking to teasing us, Mr. Odelia. I suppose. Truly, Bertha, this isn't the time. Why, I'm not teasing anyone. This is a legitimate question. It doesn't matter who saw them first, Bertha. What matters is that they're here and they're not leaving no matter what we do. This is an omen, that's what it is. Come now, Odelia, let's get you home. Fuck. I should have... I, I should not have trusted reverse psychology. <laughs> Uh, is Lumkuhan anywhere here? Oh, there she is. You look awful, Lumkuhan. It's no wonder, is it? Seeing Apfel so heal had me worrying about him all night. Miss, Lid Miss Elizabeth said he was mumbling to himself. He was having convulsions, speaking of the witch, too. Sounds like he's been listening to too much of... Old Yochin's nonsense, that's what. I think so too. What about Alphil's hands? What was that about? I'd say he did that to himself. He was gripping his fist the entire time, so... Say, Lepkun. If this is about last night, Elisa... What else was it... What else would it be about, Lev? I'm worried about you. They gave me a lecture is all. Mr. Gustav was very supportive of me, but Father Hans, he... Oh, that old geezer better not have. Father Hans isn't all there is either. I, I don't I don't know what that said. <laughs> Wait, actually, log. Um. Father Hans isn't all there. Isn't all there either, Lisa. There you go. What do you mean? Isn't all there? Old Yochen's very much convinced you saw those crows for a reason, and Father Han's starting to believe him, I think. Oh, for goodness sake. Be careful, Elisa. There's only so much I can do for you. I'm trying to get my suspicion up. That's probably an ending. Anyway, I need to me a uh, thingy at the viewpoint. Me, Rosa Marine, at the viewpoint. It's a day.
Though I want to see what this says. Says anything new. Nope. May the flesh serve- wait, 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 actually, yeah, that did say anything- something new. May the flesh serve him and what- was what the crow said. If that's what it takes to get there, I might as well give him everything I have. Also, hi, Frotke. You cute little guy. No, I can't- why can't I talk to him? No, talk to Frotke. Damn it, you fucking dumbass. Honestly, I don't think there's anything else in there. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. Or... Yeah. You and that goat of yours, Rosa Marina. Oh, Elisa, there's no need to be jealous. I'm not jealous of a goat, you... <laughs> Isn't she, Frokke? <laughs> How would you like to sleep with him out in the granary, Rosa Marina? Ah, uh, I'd have Frokke to hold close. I wouldn't be cold at all. Why you... Ah, but okay, don't get so close to the edge. You be careful too, Rosa Marina. You can see everything from here, can't you? I suppose... Something's on your mind, Elisa, I can tell. Can't even be left on... I can't even be left to brood in peace, can I? You're going through some changes, that's all. Some changes, you say? Your path will become clearer and clearer, you'll see. Aren't you a little too cheery? I don't know about this. I should have saved. I don't know about this. Not now, Rosa Marina, I'm not ready. You're still overwhelmed, I see. It's difficult not to be, wouldn't you say? Why don't we head back to town, Elisa? Did I not? No! I picked the wrong answer. Go back. Go back. Restart. Restart. Ah, oh, fuck. I didn't save. Shit. Alright, let me go and make tea then. Might as well. While well, I'm at it. Um, why is... Oh, yeah, it is. Alright. It is capturing. Alright. Warning, flashing lights, yes. Already seen this title screen, we don't need to see it again. Though it is amazing, it does look great. Um, hold on. Okay, hold on. Um, well, looks like I'm going to speed run through all of this again. Um, did I already talk to these two? Yes.
All right. Are you standing here all day? I understand that you like to keep guard, but isn't that a little too much? You'll be doing shifts. Uh, we'll be doing shifts at least. Like Gustav and Bernhard are up first. I see. Do you want to stand guard with us, Elisa? I hope you weren't planning on making any bread today, lass. Uh, I was actually. Might want to get some from Gretel today, Elisa. Are you certain you're not leaving, Mr. Ludwig? Wouldn't be the wise. Wouldn't be the wisest to leave it to the crows, would it? I suppose not. You can have a word with Eugen uh, if you're that keen on baking bread today. I must ask though, why are you so insistent, Elisa? Uh, I was, um... I best go see how Athel's doing, if you'll excuse me. Oh. Well. So there goes that. Um... Hold on, Tia's ready. Let me go and... And, uh, just real quick. But <sighs> I'm but all right. Uh, cool. I need to. I need to do that one thing. Hold on. Where is it? Oh, wait, I don't think it's available until later. Miss Adelia? Eek! Don't tell me you're hiding from the crows. I'm not going anywhere near those dreadful things. Oh, this is all your fault. How is this our fault, Miss Adelia? You two are hiding something, I know it. I'm gonna punch you in the face. All the ocean's been taken for a fool, but I know you. Is this because of what I said yesterday, Miss Adelia? All these awful goings on, goings on. I understand it's frightening, Miss Odea, but you can't. Oh, but these crows weren't enough, even for our children. Even our children are hexed now. What are you? Shoo, shoo. 
Leave me be, you. Fucking bitch. I'm gonna stab her. Um... Okay, no, I already talked to them. You know, I think last time I said that this game, like, this game, this game's town is like very mystery dungeon like, and you know, I think the music kind of, kind of helps with that. I think the music is also like, is also very mystery dungeon ish. No, I did not wish to see that again, but yeah, all right. I still remember that time a goat got stuck in a fence in uh, in my farm, and I still don't know how it got there to this day. Like, that is genuinely like a mystery. One thing after another, isn't that? Read this. If I, uh, yeah, I did. <laughs> there he is. Can you please talk to him? Thank you. Actually, I forgot to. Right, I forgot to talk to him again. It's a good thing I reset, because I wouldn't have, uh... Because I wouldn't actually have been able to complete that. Um... Um... I was wondering about the key. There's a piece of bread. And now, fishing up. And now suspicion is full. But I was kind of hoping that that would be like an insta-death. Say Mr. Finn, uh, wait, I already read this. Why am I still reading this? Alright. So, what happens when suspicion is all the way up? Why is there a wall there? You bring good news, I'm certain. Mr. Finn said to leave it to him, Mr. Ludwig. Atta girl, Lisa. I'm not the one looking after your cabbages, Mr. Ludwig. You still did me a favor, didn't you? Fear trouble? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, I love you. <laughs> you gave me food. <laughs> I desperately needed food. <laughs> you didn't have to, Mr. Ludwig, but thank you. No, you had to. You had to. I would have killed you if you didn't. I'm best go tell Bertha our cabbages will be in good hands. <laughs> Alright. I think it's imperative that the save file is... 
is separate. <laughs> uh, there's something else in the village, I feel like. I don't know why I'm bothering. Um... Let's go back to that date. Time with her. All right. Let's see, frog. Um. Wait. Oh wait. Did they? Did they switch places? Because didn't I pick? I don't know about this. Aren't you a little too cheery? It almost feels like you're mocking me, Rosa Marina. Come now, Lisa, give me your hands. What are you... Let's dance, Lisa. You're going too fast, Rosa Marina. We're approaching the full moon, Lisa. You know what that means. How would I know such a thing? It's time to celebrate new beginnings! Our new beginnings, together. What new beginning, Rosa Marine? Not making sense! Why, you following your dreams, Elisa? The fulfillment of my purpose, too. I mean, we're literally following our dreams, like, quite literally. <laughs> Everything's come together just the way the stars told me it would. We have to celebrate our good fortune, Elisa. Wait, Rosa Marine, you're spinning too fast. I didn't think... I used to dance with Granny like this every month and I... You swung your Granny around like this? Every month. You're truly... Whether you believe me or not, Elisa, let me put it this way. You see that castle in the distance, don't you? Yeah, that's been my final goal, apparently. Also... Was there just a random, like... Like, open... Like, a... I think... Like, where the mountains were, there was, like... It wasn't fully, like... Like, it didn't fully cover, like, nothingness. Yes? It may seem far away from where you stand now, but... The stars are even further away, yet they still guided me to you, didn't they? Are there any other places with pretty views in Kifferberg? I suppose the windmill's not bad. Will you meet me there tomorrow afternoon, then? Our new beginning together, she says. Elisa? I'll be there, Rosa Marina. We'd best head back now.
Hold on. There she is. Forgive us, Elisa. Let go of me. This is as far as you go, Elisa. It's because my suspicion is all the way up. You heard him, lass. We've had it with the likes of you witches. What the fuck? Why did she, like, spaz out? What the f What's the meaning of this, father? This is for your own good, Elisa. You must put a stop to this before it's too late. Oh, I'm so sorry, Elisa. It's time you confess, Elisa. Confess to what, you... Your witchery, lass. All of Kieferberg knows what you're scheming. We found an effigy in your home, Elisa. In Old Hole's bedroom. You broke into Granny Hole's bedroom? Your cousin, too. We can't be certain about who she truly is. A witch. Both of them wretched witches. We're not witches, you old fool. If only there was a way to be certain, Elisa. Mr. Gustav. We need to make certain this stops here, or... Oh, please. Please forgive me, I never intended to... Not one more word, folks. Away with the witches. You can't do this. Mr. Gustav, you of everyone must know this is wrong. Elisa's hey, right, Papa. We can't do this to them. You're to stay here until dawn, whether you're witches or not. You can't leave us here, you old fuck. What exactly is meant what exactly is this meant to achieve, Father? Perhaps. Time will prove them innocent. However, if the witch's torment comes to a halt, we will know they're behind these horrors. It's our only chance to protect Kiefer Bergalisa. Let us hope this all comes to an end tonight. Fools. I'm sorry, Elisa. This is all because I... This isn't the time for your self-pitying nonsense, Rosa and Marina. Can't you see where... What was that? You've come to me at last. What? My beloved... Progeny. And now I'm, I truly turn into a witch. Or not. Wait, that's it? Get tied for witchcrafting. That's it? I was expecting like a... Like a more... Um... Hold on. This is the... Yep, yeah, okay, no, no, no. I can't use this one. I was expecting like a like a unique game over, but guess not. So I'm gonna have to do a few things again, again. Alright, uh, now I just gotta make sure that my suspicion goes down. <laughs> but also, what the hell did they find in... In... 
in Granny Hall's bedroom. So I feel like that was a spoiler more than anything else. draw them away. Gotta see the goat again. God damn it, of all places to reset, why now? <laughs> Maybe I should eat that, um, that soup or whatever it was, the hearty soup. Data's available, so we gotta get it on. Um, but I also need to make sure that um, that now I get my suspicion down. God, I'm so glad the skip pitch, the skip feature is there. Like, it's so much better than just, like, spamming A to... To get what you want. Um... You're rather trusted, Mr. Eugen. With the key to the windmill, even. Bless is right, Eugen. It's a shame for you to leave. Nothing I can do about that, folks. There's nothing like for me here in Kieferberg, you see. Still, I think everyone would miss you, Mr. Eugen. Please reconsider. No, I've made up my mind, but I do appreciate it, Elisa. Even this key, I will only be holding on to it until evening. Until the evening, Mr. Eugen? It's too much responsibility, Les. I'm not too comfortable with it in my pocket, I must admit. Why not hand it over to someone else, then? I could take it to Mr. Gustav if you'd like. That's alright, Elisa. There's no better place... Uh, there's no better place than Kieferberg, lad. It's not getting suspicious di suspicion down. Um, I should eat this because I'm low on health and on bread. Um, oh wait, 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 wait. How do I get my suspicion down? <laughs> Oh, uh, that means I, I had to give give up on that piece of bread. Wait, no, that's not what I wanted to talk to. I talked to the windmill by accident. No, just shit. Um. Mm -hmm.
Actually, I want to see what happens when you click on I'm the Witch. I'm going to load right afterwards, but maybe that might be like a, like a secret little thing. Actually, it's these ones. Um, I thought it was the one Freya is talking to. Uh, it's because I'm the witch. That's what you want me to say, isn't it? You take us all for fools, don't you, Elisa? Don't rile, don't rile her up like that, Bertha. Or what, Miss Odelia? Now that was a proper threat if I've ever heard one. We have nothing to gain from all this animosity, Bertha. You're the only one claimed to have seen those crows, Elisa. I don't know what you want me to say, you... It's best you apologize, Bertha, unless she... You're accusing me of witchery now, are, we, are you? Why, we did no such thing. Bertha didn't mean what she said, Elisa. You're all seeing what I saw yesterday, a bunch of crows. Make that what you will, ladies. Yeah, 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 um... But I know picking the other option gets my suspicion down, and I kind of need that right now, because I am on... I am on witch's door right now. <laughs> There's nothing else I can say. Suspicion down. All right. Actually, yeah, no, I don't need to save. Alright, let's go have our third date of the day with Rose and Marine. Wait, actually. I'm curious as if, like, someone will be here. Oh, wait, the crows are here now. They weren't here before, right? I'm pretty sure, at least. It's like they know. Which they do. Spend time with her. Cool. Aren't you a little too cheery? So now I shouldn't get burned to the ground. I hope. I mean, I wasn't burned, I was tied to a tree and then stabbed to death, but still. There we go, alright. I'm alive! Fuck it, I'll eat that fucking soup. Because to be fair, it's not like it's doing anything to save it. Also, um... Bray at the village, Rosa and Marina at the windmill, that's tomorrow. Uh... Play kiss her up with the kids, help Wilhelm with the chickens. Why it's only those two? Can't I chop wood? I would really love to chop wood right now. <laughs> 
That was the only mini game I'm good at here. Actually, now that I've been there, I wonder if there's something up in that wind. I, you, you've already been in that windmill, you moron. Unless I missed something, but I don't think I did. Because why would it still be open? Let me let me save. Hold on. <laughs> Let me save because it's important that I have sanity. My sanity is way down. So... Is this door still open? It is. Uh, I found a fish key here. I guess... Maybe if I try something else. Yeah... No, I, I need... I need a key to open that door. But, I don't think I have it. What is the... I don't know. Maybe I'll find it somewhere. In fact, you know what? Just because I... Just because I want to refill my sanity, I'm just gonna load the safe hole back up. Alright. Where can I possibly find... Hunt. Diary Entry 2. And what was this again? This is a damn piece of paper. Complex, reverse, financial station, the human... Wait! Hold on. Oh my god. I just realized I'm a fucking idiot. Please tell me I'm right. Please. Why can't I... I can't select that. I've always wondered what lies beyond those hills. Spotted the isolated homes and rows of crops. The broad valley... Uh, the Broad Valley's fields spread out into the distance. Wait. I swear I could interact with this before. Is it because... It's because Lab Kuhan is here, isn't it? I can't do anything supernatural with, with uh, people around. Hiding from those folks, are you, Leb? It's that obvious, isn't it? To me, yes. 
Folks have been have been hounding me all day is all. I don't want to admit it, Alisa, but I made a mess of that whole ordeal. I'm truly sorry, Lepkin. I didn't mean to trouble you. That's not what I was going to say, but please continue. <laughs> I feel awful about it. I know you do, Elisa. It doesn't matter anymore. What were you going to say then? That we have to take all these things... Uh, all these going-ons seriously, Elisa. There's no witch, Lepkuen. I mean, I think you've met the witch at this point. Yet, folks are losing their wits all the same, aren't they? Best keep calm is what you're saying. Say, Elisa. You're hiding something from me, aren't you? You're putting yourself in danger, aren't you? Lepkuhen? You know me. You know I can tell when something's not right. It's nothing to worry about. In truth, it's not even... Whatever it is, Elisa. I won't be able to help you with it. Not when you keep secrets from me. And not when... No, I won't say it. Lepkuhen, I truly... Be careful, Elisa. That's my only request. I'm not about to drag Lebkuen into this. This is something I ought, I ought to do myself, by myself. Remind me to come back here. I, I... I know that fish and the fish key are connected. She'd be better off marrying Eugen, I'd say. Who's marrying Mr. Eugen? Oh, Bertha's jesting, Elisa. You have to agree, Marlin. They're about the same age, too. You can't be talking about Miss Lisbeth. Who else would I be talking about, Elisa? Now, we can't be spreading this nonsense about town, you hear? It's far from nonsense. Those children need a proper father. Eugen's leaving first thing next Monday, anyhow. A big mistake, if you ask me. I'm not too certain about Eugen myself, but... I must agree, poor Lisbeth would be better off. Now, if she was... if she'd remarried. It's a good thing Apfel's feeling better, Elizabeth. No use in brooding now. It'll only wear you out even more. Oh, I can't help but worry. Mr. Bernhardt is right, Miss Elizabeth. Even so, you must keep an eye on the children. How's your hearse, Eugen? Tired. Uh, wait, tired still. Poor things lying about in the hay. So are my goats. To think someone would do such a thing. I've been keeping calm, not wanting to rile folks up, but... You've been too calm, I'd say. Cursing Kieferberg to hell won't bring my horses back, Bernhard. Someone ought to have done it, that's all I have to say. I must say, I'm starting to understand how those folks feel. Miss Lisbeth. It's certainly easier to believe there's a witch, isn't there? It's rather... It's rather tricky, now that we don't have Eugen's horses. You could lend us a hand, Freya. Oh, Elisa, won't you tell Papa to stop before he... Uh-huh. Freya's as strong as I am, believe it or not. Looking rather fl fl bleh. looking rather flustered, aren't you, Freya? Because he makes it sound as if I'm a... I'd say it's an asset, not a fault, Freya. I'm not that strong anyhow. I must say, I'm curious to see... Wait, I must say, I'm curious to see that now, lass. Don't pressure her, Ainrich. Oh, but even I would le like to see how strong she is. Alright, alright. <laughs> Jesus Christ. How's this then? I can't believe it. Gustav weighs much more as... Uh, Gustav weighs as much as a horse, but look at that. She barely broke a sweat, too. That's my daughter. Atta girl, Freya. 
Not in front of Elisa, too. Huh? This is the kind of cheer Kieferberg needs. Truly, I'm tired of hearing about this witch. Alright. That was kind of funny, though. Admittedly. We are just talking about you, dearie. Me? Mr. McTilda? Oh, Elise, aren't you scared of those crows? They're more of a nuisance, I'd say. See, Brunhilde? Elise doesn't let it get to her. But there are so many. They haven't attacked anyone, have they? No, not at all. They're just hopping about town, it seems. It certainly is strange, but I don't think there's much harm. You don't think there's a witch about town, Miss McTilda? I'm not old enough to know such things. Wait. I'm not old enough to know such things don't exist, Brunhilde. Truly, Miss Brunhilde, you can't listen to those old folks. Oh, I suppose that's true. Wait. There she is. Catch her. Huh? Come play kiss her out with us, Elisa. Aren't you sick, Apfel? Not anymore. I've been at home resting all day. Apfel hates kiss kiss the rat, but we but he can watch us. Oh please, Elisa, please. I don't think so. You're still recovering, Apfel. Head on home now. But Elisa, I'm not sick anymore. No means no. Or would you rather have me go tell Miss Lisbeth? Oh, all right. Well, stay put. Just. Don't tell her. Hold on. Let me... Where's the chicken one? Hey. This is tiring, Rosa Marina. Asking about town, you mean? No. I don't think we can count on that. Oh my god, I'm hearing... Yeah, there she is. I should have chosen my words a little more carefully, I suppose. That's alright, Elisa. We'll find a way. It's a little too late for that, Rosa Marina. If only I could turn back time and attempt it again. <laughs> well, <laughs> you can, but I'm not going that far back. You got me fucked up. Either way, Elisa, folks are rather restless. You haven't been asking about town yourself, have you? No, of course not. Alright, well... I'll call for you if I need you. I'll be here, Lisa. Oh my god, hold on, let me... Alright, let me get my suspicion up. That's enough. I'm not giving you... I'm not giving you one more crumb. But you promised. You promised me some Lebkuhen. I promised you nothing. Mercy. Folks already think it's strange, Elisa. That you knew about the crows since yesterday. You know what? Why don't you go ahead? Who's to believe a scrawny little squeaker like you anyhow? Old Yochen does, Elisa. Miss Odelia does too. How do they? What are you telling them, then? That I saw you talking to those crows yesterday. There was a golden one, too, wasn't there? Why, you... <laughs> Following you about town is truly so much fun, Elisa. I just know you have the Lepku and you promised me tucked away somewhere. I don't think I do. Yep. I finished everything. Leave. <laughs> Off of you, Mandy. I'm not giving you anything. Now leave. But you promised. You promised you that I didn't give- I didn't promise you shit. Alright? Get the fuck out of here before I slap your face into the stratosphere. Why don't you tell them then? Oh, but I will. I will tell them, Elisa. That you saw me speaking to some birds as if they believe- as if they believe you. Uh, I'll tell them what you said too. Is that so? What did I say then? Uh, uh, you said that, uh, you- out of my sight, Molly. Bring me some soup tomorrow, or else... Or else what, you little shit? I'm gonna finish that for her. 
Eek. I should have given her what she wanted, but... Ah, to hell with it. Hold on, let me see. Oh, wait, she gives two suspicion points. Should weave in more of the uh you should weave in more of the blue flowers, Linda. Didn't didn't we leave the maple to Freya this year? Freya clearly has better taste anyhow. I don't remember inviting you to this conversation, Lassie. Come now, Miss Wilma. Freya's not even finished with it yet. I'd say she'd be sad if you changed it without telling her, Miss Wilma. Why, I'd never do such a thing. I trust her judgment. I'm having her lend a hand with the with the wreaths too. So you can find even more faults in her work, I, I see. I haven't asked you for a hand for a reason. It's best we keep calm. Yeah, I need to get my suspicion down fast. Um Is there seriously no one in church? Come on. Really? Anyone? Oh wow, there's crows here too. Oh shit, hold on. God damn. They're like fucking everywhere. I think I've been here yet, have I? Don't go losing your wits like that, Odelia. It may be best to rest for the day, Miss Odelia. Is everything alright? Eek! What's gotten into her? Odelia's terrified of the crows, Elisa. Old Yochen's right. It's that lassie and her cousin. Oh, for goodness sake. This isn't good for you, Odelia. Think about your health. Your heart can't take much more. No, let her die. Oh, but I can't settle down, Mariel. The Lord is with Kieferberg. We must not forget that. You ought to put your faith in him, Miss Odelia. That's right, Odelia. You can't get swayed by whatever Old, Yo old Yochen says. Do I look like a witch to you, Miss Odelia? Oh, I wouldn't know, lass. What do you mean you wouldn't know? Don't rile her up, Elisa. We'll take care of her. Don't you worry, dearie. Damn it. It's best you start confessing, Dorothea. A mother's sin passed on to her child, you know. A mother's sin is passed on to her child, you know? Oh, for goodness sake. Why, it's a fact, Elisa. What you ought to do, uh, Dorothea, is swear your rosary all nine months. Oh, I will, I will. But Brunhilde, she... What about Miss Brunhilde? She's been doing these divinations. I don't think those work anyhow. Why not let her then? Why not let her then? I think that's the right answer. Miss Brunhilde is so anxious. I might make her settle down a little. Elisa! How can you say such a thing, lass? Ha! Huh? Truly, Elisa, this is rather dangerous. Whether we believe in the witch or not, she could hurt herself. I don't know what you've been doing behind our backs, Elisa, but... Where is this all coming from? All I'm saying is that Miss Brunhilde is an adult, and as such... Brunhilde is rather gullible, Elisa, we all know that. Oh, you'd best get Elisa away from Brunhilde, Dorothea. Why you... Yep, nope. That is a reset. Um... I have to be careful, I wouldn't want folks suspecting me. Um... Where is this Gaki? 
There she is. I don't have it. <laughs> Alright. At least I can get my suspicion down, so... I don't think those work anyhow. It's an old wife's tale and whatnot. Still, Lisa, it could be harmful if she goes too far. But this witch nonsense about town, too. It may have been her who brought us all these crows, even. Oh, for goodness sake, Miss Lorelei. Honestly, Lorelei, we can't go around making accusations left and right. Should never do such a thing, Miss Lorelei. All right, all right. You don't have to pound something like that. There we go. Let me uh, go around a little more. My back. Is there really no one here? <laughs> They've had their fill, I'd wager. The crows, Mr. Guido? They've been circling the windmill all morning, the bastards. Yet, they haven't come for the grain even once. Would you say they won't? If they haven't attempted it... If they haven't attempted it until now... Who's to say, Elisa? We can't leave the windmill. That's... That's what. Ah, no. I was... I was saying that maybe now... They're not coming for the grain because we're here, I'm certain. Did come di diving down the moment we left, I wager. That's a given. Yes. I suppose. Yeah, fuck you, you brat. I guess I should probably help this guy. Are you want to eat a lot of eggs, Elisa? What else is there to eat in this town, anyhow? Oh, you have enough for a hog or two, I'm certain. Huh. Anyhow, when you fetch me a few eggs for supper? All right. But you know what? Let's have you let's have you pitch in for that hog. What do you say? If you bring me the entire coop, I will. Do you need Rosa Marina? Yes. Out of my way, you feathered rat. Um. Oh, helping hand. Bring Rosa Marina along for a chore. Oh. Now let me try using my keyboard instead of my controller. This might be easier. All right, Z. Round one, two, one, go.
Oh, this is much easier, I think. Shit, what happened? I hate how every time you pick a chicken, there's just this pause. Like they have to do this like Zelda picking up item kind of kind of animation. Score 37, rank A. Yes. Nope, nope, I'm good. Okay, yeah, keyboard is much easier for uh, for this mini game. You win. I'm curious what happens if you like shit up lose. I'm curious to see the art for that. All right, all right. You did well, Elisa. Here you go, for your time. Thank you, Mr. Wilhelm. Wow, I never had this much money before. Think of me when you get that hug, you hear? Is he mocking me or... I don't know, but I am going to be buying some stuff. Also, oh my god. Um, I don't have any food. Well, uh, looks like I'm gonna be needing to get some bread. Oh, hello there. Uh, I'll come back to you too. Because otherwise, I'm going to forget about, um, about food. Um, <laughs> guess I'll only all buy myself in the sin. I'm buying. Oof, this is just health. Fuck. Wait. Wait a goddamn minute. Hold up. Did it? Eh? Did... I know what happened. I reset the game before I got the the sausage. <sighs> Shit. One's good judgment. Gave me a good amount. Um, let me go buy some bread. I I think I need to buy like two pieces because of. Never mind. I need three because um because bringing um 
bringing Rosa Marina along will cost three pieces of bread, and that's literally all I would have otherwise. Wait. Wait, no, because then the day would pass. Oh, no, 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 never mind. No, I was thinking wrong. Um, I could grab a lab. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm too poor for that. Oh, wait, I'm too poor for bread. Um, I'm, I can only afford one. Can I sell anything? Um, have this. Hmm. Can I sell this? Maybe I should have just worked myself like a dog for the whole game. <laughs> uh, I don't think I can bring Rosa Marina along. I'm pretty sure I can't eat this. Now, please tell me that there isn't anyone where the where the thing is. Wait, what? Please don't tell me that I... That I missed my, uh... uh I'm gonna go save real quick. I'm gonna go save. I'm just gonna see if if there was another time where I if I if I had to do it earlier. It's as though you've never had a fever yourself, old Yotan. Though I was crying out to the witch, MacTilda. Where exactly did you hear such nonsense, Mr. Yotan? Ah, uh, Elisa, finally someone to talk some sense into this fool. Lisbeth herself said the lie was delirious, lass. Miss Lib Miss Lisbeth never said anything about a witch, Mr. Yochan. You ought to stop spreading this nonsense about town. Pooks are already tense enough as is, Yochan. Old Stefan warned warned us about this MacTilda. If I may ask, old Yochan, what's so special about old Stefan's word? I must say I'm curious too. Old Stefan knew Kieferberg was to face many trials, lass. And now we're seeing them right before our eyes. What about the witch then? Very true, I'm yet to see her out and about, Yochen. Time will reveal all, I say. I'm curious. Let's do this. Slot 8. Whichever one this was.
How many afternoons have I spent here washing these folks' clothes, I wonder? And I don't have the key for this. What about... Slot 9. Wait, I do have the... The fish. No, I don't. I think the game just doesn't want me to... To use this... Because I think... I should have the key by now, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. So once you get the key, you can't even interact with this anymore. Also, wait. Oh, wait. They, uh, all right, can't interact with that. Okay. Um, you were Mario, right? No, that's Alma. Maybe later. Hmm. I was wondering, Elisa. Don't you find it strange the crows are still hanging about town? Now that you mention it. I already got the testament. There's no real reason for them to stay. Unless there's something else they want from you, Elisa. Such as? Oh, I wouldn't know. Something else they're wanting. They've guided you to the windmill. I suppose that was nice of them. Ah, how nice of them indeed. It may be they're waiting to tell you something else. We'll see about that, Rosa Marina. You want wood, right? Wait, actually, I'm rather busy today. That's all right, Les. I'll see if Frey can do it for me. No, I'll, I'll be back. Um, I just need to. Don't touch it, Grune. It doesn't matter, Jacob. It's dead. Why in the Lord's name are you two doing to that thing? Eek. E Elisa. Good grief. You know better than to touch that bill. Oh, please, don't tell Mama. It fell from the sky, Elisa. We were playing with it. We were playing and it fell from the sky, I swear. Alright, fine. Stop yelling. It fell from the sky, you say? Straight down. Jacob thinks it might have been sick, but... Don't you dare touch it, Grune. Don't yell at me, Elisa. Abfeld was the one who saw it first, Elisa. He ran off to find some rocks for the funeral. The funeral? Whose funeral? The crows, Elisa. Uh, Just... Don't touch it, whatever you do. There is no crow. I can't see it. What about your mama, Grune? I don't want to talk about it. Apfel says, said Miss Lisbeth isn't feeling so well. Go away, Elisa. You're not invited to the funeral. Grune. God, that... I really need that sausage. I must apologize, Lass. To me, Mr. Bernhard? Had we believed you last night, we could have prepared ourselves. I can't... I can't say I see how, if I'm being honest. 
We could have blocked the granary for starters. Makes one wonder why they're perched here in Kieferberg. It's a rare sight, that's for certain. Have you seen crows here before, Bernhard? A long time ago, almost 20 years ago. It wasn't nearly as bad as this, however. It's best we have a word with Father Hans. About what, Mr. Heinrich? Kieferberg needs some direction, Elisa. I must agree, Heinrich. Shit. Gustav's struggling to find common ground with Father Hans, too. It's true Father Hans doesn't seem too concerned, that's for certain. We must tell him his folks need him. Uh. Best not get too close, lass. Lord knows they might swoop down from that brooch of for that brooch of yours. Aren't you making too much of it, Mr. Tristan? No, he's right, Elisa. It is dangerous. I can't seem to settle down with these crows flying or flying about. And Apfel's fever, too. What if it's contagious? Apfel's feeling better already, Mr. Tristan. Father Hans is urging us to stay calm, folks. We must see to our duties, nothing more. Easier said than done, Ludwig. Mr. Tristan. There was a fat Tristan. Nothing strange about that. Apfel's fever was just that, a fever. And I'd wager these crows will give up on our grain soon enough, too. I'm still not convinced, Ludwig. Okay, so I don't think that, uh... Oh! I can jump down. I don't know. I thought it was just, uh... Exclusive to the woods. Um... God, I'm so mad about that sausage. Oh. I would be running home if I were you, Elisa. What? Lord knows what these crows have done to it by now. The wretched things are everywhere. We've been trying to get rid of them, but they won't budge. Have they broken into anyone's home, or... Not yet, but they most definitely could. They're thieves, like rats. You best hide that brooch of yours, Elisa. At least, at least they steal it. You're making too much fun of it. Wait, you're making too much of it, Miss Marlin. Have you heard about Apfel, Elisa? That he had his hands pecked by the crows? That's nothing but hearsay, Bertha. My, but isn't it horrifying? Apfel gripped his fist too tightly, nothing more. Oh, you'd say... Oh, you'd say that's it? Of course that's it, Bertha. Ludwig says... He'll have a word with Father Hans about it, but... No one to get my suspicion down. Eh, I mean, I'm fine for now. Understood, Maddie? Oh, but my auntie's going to... What have you done now, Molly? Ah, Elise. It's not what you think. I didn't... She stole one of Miss Alma's buns. She had cooling on the windowsill. No, I didn't. She gave it to me, and... Miss Alma had me give Molly here a good earful. Does your auntie not feed you, Molly? It's complicated. She doesn't? I I'm still a growing lass, Elise. Eight buns a day isn't enough. Eight? Either way, Missy. It it's Muffy. Why can't any of you... Sitting is never justified, alright? You can come to me if you ever need anything. Oh, Lepkuhen. If only Elisa was as kind as you. Why you? M maybe it's best you go home to rest, Lepkuhen. I'll go with you, then you can get me some pretzels. Oh, for goodness sake, Mindy. 
Why don't you go ask Granny Gretel? Tell her I sent you. She'll give you anything you want. Hooray, hooray! Can I get free food too? I didn't know you were... Uh, I didn't know you were coming with Elisa. Where to, Miss Linda? We're stopping by Lisbeth's, Elisa. Oh my, poor Jacob won't settle down. It's taking a toll on the children, that's for certain. I mean to ask her if they would like to spend the night with us. They'd appreciate spending some time together, I'd wager. Lisbeth will most likely want to watch over Apville, Linda. Oh, that's true. Apville's seen those goats, he tells me. That's such a horrible sight for someone his age. I'll come about later, too. I'm concerned about Miss Lisbeth. Oh, me too. Her being a widow is also... What does that have to do with any of this, Miss Brunhilde? Truly, Brunhilde, don't be so superstitious. Oh, I suppose. Alright, I'm gonna go chop the wood. You better not talk to anyone, you hear me? Alright. Have you found the time, Elisa? I'll do it for you, Miss Marielle. It seems I have, after all. Oh, thank you, Elisa. I'm so glad I can count on you, my dear. Cost two extra? I don't have enough. Take back what I said about this being the only game I'm good at. Rank A, okay. It's still an A, it's fine. Try again. No. Ah, I knew I could count on you, my dear. Here you go, Elisa. For a job well done. Thank you, Miss Marielle. Just gonna get bread. 
Wait. Leb gives me free bread, doesn't she? Meet Leb at the bakery. Okay, yeah, yeah. you know what? Never mind, never mind. Um... I'm gonna... Sell this. I am struggling with items. Like, I'm barely managing. I'm buying... What are you buying? The roast turkey. <sighs> you sure that's all, sweetheart? Absolutely. Because I have nothing right now. Like, I'm just barely getting by. I had to give up on my date with Freya. Long day today, was it, dearie? For you too, Miss Matilda? Not at all. I had a lovely nap just earlier. I can't remember the last time I took a nap. Let's call it the perks of old age, my dear. There are many, but I make the most of it. You're rather cheery, Miss Matilda. Why, most of the crows are gone, Elisa. That's a relief, I must say. Makes one wonder... Makes one wonder why, doesn't it? Sure does, Miss Matilda. Sure does. Alright. Leb. I am in desperate need of your bread. I'm in desperate need of those buns, if you know what I mean. Wait, Elisa. Shit. Please, man, I'm hungry. There you are, lassie. Huh? We need to have a word with you, Elisa. A word with me, you say? Your cousin's been going about town spreading nonsense, Lisa. Such as? Why, saying the crows are nothing to fret about, for instance. She's a kind soul, Miss Alma. What does that matter? She's a kind soul. She isn't afraid of any animals, on the con- She isn't afraid of any animals, on the contrary. I see how that might be true, Lisa, but still. We're to be wary of such things. Not make little of them. I understand, Miss Alma. This is dangerous. I ought to make certain. I ought to make certain I bring Rosemary Marinet to work with me, or I'll have to deal with this every day. Damn it, old Marine, I left you alone for one second. Why does it take three bread? I don't have that kind of money. Why are you here? Eek! Oh, please, Elisa, don't tell my auntie. What in the Lord's name are you doing out here, Mally? I've had it with her, Elisa. She's always... She always wants me working all day. Perhaps she needs your help, Mindy. She only likes me when I'm working. I'm certain she wouldn't look for me if I went missing. You haven't seen Apfel by chance, have you? I... I was looking about, but... That's alright, Molly. You won't tell my auntie, will you? Not after what you just told me, no. Still, you best not try her patience too much, you hear? Oh, Elisa. Since you like me so much, when you give me some... For goodness sake, Miffy. There's a rat. Like a little mouse. A little guy. You're so cute. Leb, please give me some bread. <laughs> give me those buns of yours. I know, Elisa. I haven't said anything yet, have I? You don't have to, Elisa. What am I to do with you, Leb Kuhen? At least let me tell you. Let me. Uh, at least tell me you'll get a good night's sleep tonight. If nobody else breaks into a fever, I might. Here's your bread, Elisa. Thank you. I could use a little more, admittedly, but thank you. What's on your mind, Lev Kuhan? Things that would upset you, Elisa. I'm not certain I... I'm not certain you trust me at all. I trust you enough to not ask... Uh, I trust you enough to not ask you about it. You keep coming back to this, Lev. If there is... I meant it, Elisa. You don't have to tell me. Whatever it is, 
You can't tell me, I won't pry. You trust me that much, huh? Even if you truly were the witch. That good hand. I mean it, Elisa. I trust you'll tell me in time, whenever you're ready. You're truly... Tired. For someone who's so attentive to others, Lebkuhen, uh, you're not. I'll see you about- I'll see you about town tomorrow. For goodness sake, you're so stubborn. Thank you, Lev. I really need this bread. Um... But also, I'm gonna... No, actually, no, never mind. See you, Granny. Uh... Ask Eugene about- oh, that's later. Um... Have dinner with Rosa and Marina. Okay, that's the only thing I need to do. Elise! Elise, come quick. What's the matter, Jacob? It's Apfel, he's gone missing. What? Oh, please come quick, Elisa. We must go and look for him. That's right, we can't sit sit about waiting forever. What's going on here? Apfel's gone missing, Elisa. Hopefully the lads will... Uh, find him on their patrol. They will happen upon him, I'm certain. They don't know he's missing, father. <laughs> By the time they're back, my poor boy could have... Mama! We all need to remain calm. Calm, father? My boy is missing. Lord knows if he's alright, let alone... If the worst has happened. We all knew those crows were an omen. Not, a, not this again, you old wretch. Ought to have taken the lad to the witch. What a horrible thing to say, old Yoshin. You truly have no decency, you. We cannot give in to hysteria, brethren. Oh, to think the lad's... We're now in search of the crows. The crows were a threat, lass. Oh, that's it. I'm going. I'm going to look for him myself. I'll go. I be the one to go, Miss Elizabeth. It's best we wait for the lads. I can. I can't allow. Oh, were you really, Elisa? Now, there's a brave lass. Oh, but Father Hans is right. It's dangerous. Leave it to me, Miss Elizabeth. Oh, Elisa. I do not condone your disobedience, Elisa. I do. I need you to go, Elisa. For Angelica's sake as well. Truly, the poor lass can't be without a mother. We can land a hand with whatever you need, Elisa. Can I have food? Like, can I can I stock up on food, please? You best make you best make certain you have enough food and matches, my dear. Uh, I have enough matches. I desperately need food. I'll be here, Elisa. Let me know when you're when you're leaving. Oh, I'm certain he's alright, dearie. I can only hope you're right, Miss Marielle. We must keep a positive outlook, Miss Elizabeth. I thought you didn't condone my disobedience, Father. My duty is to care for my brethren's well-being, Elisa. You ought to be aware it is dangerous. The last couldn't bear the... F the last couldn't bear the thought, Father. 
We can't leave Abel roaming the woods all by himself. Lord knows how sick he was yesterday. If that fever were to strike again in those woods... I'll make certain I find him, Miss Lisbeth. I appreciate it, Lisa. But... If you find it too dangerous... Elisa will find him, Elizabeth. We must trust the lass. Here you go, Elisa. Please be careful. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Miss Elizabeth. Wait, actually, no. That's not food. Wait, no. Fuck you. <laughs> you bitch. We will make certain to send the lads after you when they arrive. Don't wander too far, you hear? Thank you, Elisa. First it was that awful fever, and now this? Miss Lisbeth looks horrified. I can't even imagine. We can only hope he hasn't broken into a fever again, wherever he is. What you can do is bring him back to Kieferberg as fast as you can, Elisa. There's only so much one can do after all. Oh, I wouldn't know what to do if this happened to me. You best keep a close eye on Maggie, Miss Lorelei. Mary? She can look after herself just fine, like, lass. I like how even her aunt can't say her name correctly. Better than most fo folks here in Kieferberg, I'd say. Miss Lorelei, poor Mandy's still a child. Oh, there's much you don't, uh, you don't yet know about her, Dorothea. Such as? She wouldn't let herself starve, for starters. Do I need to save file? I'm gonna assume not. If I do, well, sucks to suck. My Elisa, I wasn't expecting you to volunteer of all people. I was rather brave of you, Elisa. I couldn't sit and do nothing. My, how fearless. Truly, with all this talk about the witch and whatnot. If only the lads were in town. Who knows, they might find him... Out and about. They don't even know to look for Apple, Elisa. It could happen nonetheless, Wilma. Do you have any everything you need, Elisa? I believe I do, Miss Alma. I, I really don't. Elisa, don't lie to them. Why don't you take this? Oh, thank you. Bandages, oh. No, wait, that's... That's not food, though. That's not much, I know. Thank you, Miss Alma. Well, don't expect any charity from me, lassie. Be careful, Elisa. Let me go with you, Elisa. You're not going anywhere, Jacob. I'm a man too. Apfel needs us, Granny. Elisa doesn't need you getting in her way, Jacob. Your mother's right, Jacob. I wouldn't get in the way. I wouldn't. You can look after... Wait, I can't look after you and myself at the same time, do you understand? Oh, but I wouldn't... We must trust Elisa, Jacob. I know you're hurting, Jacob, but she's right. Mama. I'll do my best to find him, Jacob, I promise. Alright, Elisa. Oh, Elisa. Maybe it's best one of us goes with you. I'll be fine, Miss Matilda. You can always change your mind, Lisa. Lebkuhin's right, Lisa. Who's to go if I don't, Freya? Well, that's... It's a good thing that you volunteered, Lisa. You're a capable lass. I'm certain you'll find him. Thank you, Miss Ariane. I'm wondering how we didn't notice. It's no use blaming ourselves now, Miss Matilda. The children told Miss Dorothea they lost sight of Apfel. Some, sometime before nightfall, it seems. Apfel was feeling alright. It may be that... What, Freya? Perhaps he fell ill and didn't want anyone to fret. Oh, don't say such a thing. Apfel couldn't have wandered too far, anyhow. It'll be fine. Apfel got lost somewhere. I'm certain that's all there is to it. May the Lord be with you, Elisa. I need... I need food. Just like in real life. Ok, 
Can you give me free food? Well, it's worth a try. Let me go to, um, I can't be wondering about, I must find that though. Never mind. Okay, um. Save for progress, wee oui, wee. Oui. Progress saved, alright. There's crows, again. Oh, back here again. Here I am again. I have to find that pill and pass. Honestly, since I know that, like, I'm gonna be taking damage, I'll just hold off on eating food. Until I take damage, like, until I'm basically dead. Oh, well that's new. That crow's trying to tell me something, I suppose. Well, what if I go the other way, hmm? No choice but to go the other way, I suppose. If there's a golden maiden over there. Oh. This isn't where I was yesterday, is it? Apfel. Apfel, can you hear me? I have to find him. Goodness knows what could have happened to him by now. Wait, I can't... I can't see shit! There's an item there. Mosaic slab. What's this thing? A tile? That's progression, I'm pretty sure. And I completely forgot about that, but Golden Maiden. Ignorance is bliss. Has nobody ever told you that? Plenty of times, I suppose. To be unable to grasp how fortunate we are until it's too late. Charmingly tragic, isn't it? I don't see what's so charming about it. You'll come to face with it, too. The ruinous grief of your biggest, heaviest regret. What's yours, then? The same as yours. We all share the same penitence. Talking to girls like this is never a very pleasant experience, is it? Oh, Pearl Rosary. Okay, is this something to sell? Please tell me it is. Fetches a moderate price. Okay. Hopefully that's like 50 or something. There's another slab. Cool. This is shit. It's because I can't see for sh for the life of me. Two acorn. Oh. Wait, that's just health, isn't it? Yep. God fucking damn it. 
Why is there food that doesn't actually regenerate food? I cannot see anything. How the fuck do I get over there? Just... Um... Oh my god. <sighs> okay, that's how. This wall... This wall, it's a mosaic. It's missing pieces, isn't it? Missing pieces, missing pieces! Um, is it good now? Is it, is, is, is it good now? I, I, I can't, I can't tell. Um, I think it's good now. That's what I said, thank you very much. Okay. Does it have to be... I think I have to find all of them before I put them... Oh, or not, never mind. I didn't even see that. It's so hard to see with like the vision obscured. There's the other slab, so I need I only need one more. Another one. How many of these are there? I think there's only one more, I'm pretty sure. What's this? An acorn. Oh two acorn. I mean that's that's health, I guess, but I'm kind of in desperate need of food. Because all I have is that turkey that should probably be saved for, like, for like, a for, like, a more, a more desperate situation. Acorn again. An acorn. Wait, I didn't... Whoa, 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 go back! No, no, no! Ugh. Five matches. I just need... Only one more slab, but I can't find it. I don't... I don't quite have the time to wonder about this, do I? I should move along and find Apple. though. She's... Witless, she's witless. Why, you little... Oh... I see what this is. I don't like this at all. That's not it. Um. Uh, is this how it is? I don't think so, but yeah, no, that. That does not look right.
Uh, I can see where I fucked up. Like, I can, I can see exactly where I fucked up. Um... Because these are not supposed to be at the very top, they're supposed to be in the middle. Because these are clouds. No. Um... I know this is here in the middle. I think I'm kind of stuck because of this here. It's not supposed to be here. Um... Yeah, I, I'm, I'm starting to see the design, but it's in the wrong place. Um... No. Um... Okay, I see that these two connect, so that means this one goes on top here, meaning it's in the complete wrong spot. I can see how it's supposed to look, but I can't for the life of me get it to look like that. square one um oh oh no 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 that's that's correct I don't I don't think this is but I'll do this eventually. God, it's... It sucks that I can actually see it connecting, but I just... can't get it to connect. Ah! You're supposed to be here! there I'm pretty sure god why is this piece here this piece does not belong um I think that piece is in the middle but
Now, couldn't you like put the go the the slabs like in order? Like when you were placing them, you dumbass fuck. done it uh okay <sighs> this is my house no it can't be I'm imagining things I don't have time for this nonsense I ought to I ought to find that fell is this seriously not giving me anything did I seriously just do all that for nothing I truly didn't have time to bother with this thing Afro could be in danger. Does that matter for anything? Now I'm just curious. Just in case, I'm gonna save. Just in case it matters. What in the Lord's name? Oh, it does matter. It very much matters. That's my house. I must be losing my mind. An acorn. Oh. Well, this is pleasant. What? What is this? My house. My progeny. Elise. Huh? Who's there? Come closer, Elise. Delve deeper. Into my grove. What in the Lord's name? Your fate, Elise. Your genesis is in the... Tapestry. Wait, I'm more curious about going upstairs, though. Because, like, the whole upper floor is missing. Now leading nowhere, the staircase... The staircase's wrinkly and damaged steps are suspended as though floating in midair. Because I was... I was curious to see the, um, the little thing. Such a foul smell. Thick crimson blood overflows from the cauldron's shattered, shattered rim, coating everything in its vis viscous sheen. Well, guess we just gotta talk to the pastry. Pa ta tapestry. I almost said pastry. Like, what, what am I, baker? Oh. I also just realized Chad is broken. Oh. I'll worry about that later. That woman. She wished for a child of her own. Oh, let me, uh, real quick. At his doorstep, she kneeled, and she prayed, not to me, but to him. My grove became the vessel, my soil, the babe's mortal body, my very womb. They celebrated their agreement. From him came what I lack, what I failed to lay my hands upon, a human soul, to be nurtured in my womb, and later given to her as her daughter. When in truth, it's me your body belongs to, Elisa. What in the Lord's name? There's something under that 
Tapestry. This though, its insides have been my womb, used for that woman's wish. I was used, 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 used. What in the Lord's name is going on here? What are these voices trying to tell me? Wait, there's a- there's a maiden. There's a golden bitch. Get over here. Get over here, you fucking bi There you are. You're wearing my brooch, still. Huh? What is one to do with the lord- uh, When the lord fails them, would you say? Wait, what are you- our union favored by the Lord himself, and yet, my inability to bear a child drove a wedge between us. Is that Grandma? Who are you? So I did what I could. I resorted to his blessing instead. I brought him, my, be my beloved, in exchange for a baby. Wait, you can't be. All I can say to you, Elise, who's following in my steps, is that this is what my soulmate would have wanted me to do. For my sake, for our union's sake, and for yours as well. That lass, it's as if she knew me. I don't know what's going on here, but... I can't stay here any longer. I have to find and save Apfel. Whatever was in this in the center is gone, I suppose. Several candles stand in a circle surrounding an old blood-stained piece of cloth. Doesn't look very blood-stained. Compared to everything else. Oh, and now we're back here. Okay. So if you don't complete that, it's... It, um... It just skips the whole house thing. Acorn. I really love to get some food that is an acorn. There he is. Apfel! Hold tight, I'll get you out of there. Let's get you out of there and go home. The woodland. This grove. It's aching. But also Marine. Your flesh. Your blood, your love. All that's rightfully mine. My progeny. Th this thing's not Rose and Marine. I can give you all that you desire. What? My beloved daughter. What are you? This lass, Rose and Marine. Is she the one your heart desires? What are you? 
They're coming. We will meet again. A vile stench, a vile stench. Tainting our grove, tainting our grove. It's you. The lad's staying where he is, lassie. The lad's staying, the lad's staying. Appel, come now. It is a... Uh, quickly, Appel. We have to leave this place. That creature's brought him right into our break, lass. We're not about to waste a hearty meal. A hearty meal, a hearty meal. Ah, uh, my eye. Come, Appel. We'll curse you, we'll curse you. Dare not defy me. Leave the lad. Leave the lad. We'll devour him. We'll de devour him. <laughs> Apple, run. I can't. I can't move, Elisa. <laughs> He's mimicking my movements? My legs. They're moving on their own. We have to leave this place, Apfel. It is a... I'm scared. Come, Apfel. We have to move. Ah. Ah. So that's how it goes. <gasps> oh! No, that's not how it works. I guess. Alright, well, it's turkey time. I mean, at least I'll get rid of this very annoying, um... Or... I originally I thought like only the symbols that are the same on both sides work. Um but I don't think that's true anymore. Um Oh wait. Some of them move. So the pieces that aren't moving are the ones that are safe. I thought was the case. Wait. Wait, that must have been true. Uh, okay, never mind. Two paths? Because all of the other pieces are moving. Unless I'm completely wrong about... Yeah. 
No, I'm, I'm right. The pieces that move are... What? I have acorns. Might as well use them. Where the fuck are, do these go to? Surely it isn't the... Ah. So basically you can't step on these twice. Is what I'm getting from this. But... But then how? sake I'm trying to take my goddamn time oh my god let me use the arrow keys instead of my controller There we go. This took longer than it needed to. Again? Elisa, my eye. Where are we going? Watch your step, Apfel. We'll find a way. Still linked. Oh, never mind. No, they cannot be synced. Um... Ow. I didn't know that there was something there. Um... Oh wait, no, I'm I, I, I walk into it as app bell, which Oh, wait, no, I'm dumb as fuck. Hold on. This is I I'm fucking this up and like it there's not even a need for fucking it up. Uh, I uh, how am I Okay, you know what? Let's I'm just gonna reset. Wait, that reset app fell completely. What if I have app fell go? Oh, I won't be able to see him because the screen follows Nope that you know what I'm not even gonna try. 
That was a bad idea. Wait, that desynced them. Uh, well, now I can't. What the fuck is it? Yep. <sighs> well, time to try that one again. I hate this puzzle. Uh -oh. No. The fuck? I wasn't even close to a spike. Well, I've run into a problem, because this has been desynced. It's like, I can't do shit. Ugh. So taking the hit there desyncs the characters, and then you're just stuck. You literally cannot do anything after that. This is safe, right? Sink them back up. That's fine. No, no, it's not fine.
Wait, what? Wait, how am I supposed to? Here maybe? On oh, I have acorns, right? I have one acorn. Uh, I don't think I. Wait, no, I can't. What the fuck? What am I supposed to do? No. No, 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 no. This ain't right. Um... did not oh that's what it was I'm focusing too much on the single screen look look I is there any chance I win this absolutely not so now what I've made it but now what Okay, hold on. Let me... Just one step at a time. So let me sync them. Cool. Like this. What is the hitbox on those spikes? Now they're like perfectly in sync. Um uh, so I guess only one of them has to make it. I guess so. It is a I can't see where I'm going. Don't wander around too much, Appel. Try to follow my voice. Eriza, where are you? It's alright, Appel. Walk in a straight line. I'll be watching over you. I feel dizzy, Eliza. Trust me, Appel. I'm right here. I must make certain I don't lose sight of him. Also, let me save because I don't want to do that puzzle again. Oh? Eh? Wait. Nope. Nope. I can't save anymore. Well... That's fantastic. Um... S 
stupid motherfucker. Huh? What the fuck? I can't... Can't, uh... Did I just soft lock the game? Am I soft locked? I'm. If I move, there's footsteps, but I can't move. I don't know. Well, I have to do this fucking puzzle again. Great, that's amazing. But at least now I know how it works, or at least I think I do. Did not fucking touch those spikes! Um... Oh, saves, alright. Hold the fuck up. What? Um... So, uh, if I get too far, do I just die? Is that what it is? Do I have a time limit? Is that what it is? Like, do I, like, not take it slow? I was just walking to the spikes there. I am actually surprised those didn't hit me.
<laughs> ah. What? <gasps> yep, so it is a time trial. I see how it works, but it fucking sucks. Oh my god, okay. So basically, how this works, right? He moves by himself and doesn't see the gigantic fucking holes on the ground and just walks into them. What the fuck? Bitch. I should just damage boost. Hold on. Let me get the acorn. I hate those shake shaking trees one because you literally cannot like do anything like you literally like you can't afford to wait but that literally requires you to wait Please tell me this is it. I don't want to. Fuck! I almost just walked into those spikes, amazing. Oh my god, that was too close. Um Come on. Okay. Where is he? There he is. I saw him. Oh my god. Um. Just push through. Just push through. Okay. Where is he? 
You, you stupid motherfucker. Okay. Come on, this one I did damage those too. Are you right, Apfel? Elisa, I feel dizzy. Wait for me, I'm coming for you. Just jump down. Elisa, just, just jump down. Okay. Elisa. I'm with you now, Aphel. It'll be alright. Let's go now. Back to Kieferberg. Okay. Save Aphel from the Crow Woods. Mama! Oh, thank heavens you're alright. Mama, Apfel. I was so scared, Mama. You're alright now, my boy. Oh, Apfel, I thought I'd never see you again. It's alright, my... It's alright, my loves. We're together now. What a relief. Good lord, Elise. You really did find him. It wasn't easy, that's for certain. Atta girl, Lisa. Hooks told us all about it. We were about to set off after you. <laughs> this is a moment to celebrate, folks. Prepare us a feast. Wilma, we're drinking to Elisa tonight. Oh, how wonderful. I'll, re I'll get right to it. We can't compromise the festival, Wilma. There's nothing better to celebrate than this, father. The lad's right, father. We ought to celebrate. <laughs> to the inn, folks. To the inn. <laughs> what are you doing here, Rosa and Marina? You weren't coming back, so I came back for you. I saw you coming back with Apfel. He got lost in the woods. I went to look for him as all. Well. Oh, but is he alright? Say, Rosa Marine. You've been home this whole time. Haven't you? I made supper and everything. You were taking so long, I thought... Come, Elisa. We ought to celebrate. Uh, we ought to celebrate. I'll be right there, Mr. Hainrich. You head on home, Rosa Marina. I won't take too long, alright? I'll be on waiting for you, Elisa. Ah, there she is. Oh, Elisa, how can I ever repay you? Uh, can I have free food? That's alright, Miss Elizabeth. There's no need to. Nonsense, Elisa. You saved them after all. How's that, Phil? Him and Angelica are inside having their supper. I'm too fatigued to join, to join you at the end, but... That's alright, Miss Elizabeth. I won't be staying long either. Oh, if only my goats weren't so ill. I have nothing to give you as thank you, Elisa. Don't fret over such things, Lisbeth. Come, I'll keep you company. We'll all pitch in to thank Elisa tomorrow. There's surely no need. I did what I felt I should. Would you mind telling me more about how you found them tomorrow, Elisa? Of course, Miss Lisbeth. You too, Elisa. See that you get plenty of rest tonight. I'm not certain about what Apfel saw in those woods, but I'll be in serious trouble if he mentions seeing her.
Okay, where's the inn? There it is. <laughs> Atta girl, Lisa. Keeper Bird goes you a great debt, lass. Lord knows what could have happened had it not been for you. I was lucky as all. No, Elisa, I owe you an apology. What matters is that Apple is safe and sound, Father. <laughs> Cambridge is right. We have a we have good reason to celebrate. Bottoms up, everyone. <laughs> to Elisa, our bravest lass. To Elisa, to Elisa. <laughs> oh, you don't have to. Nonsense, lass. This is better than the festival, even. A great deal better, indeed. It's our chance to unwind, folks. Why don't you grab some ale and go grab Freya for a dance, Elisa? <laughs> ah, yes. We're drinking all night long, lads. <laughs> to Elisa! We would have lost the poor lad if it weren't for... Ah, there she is, our bravest lass. You're making too much of it, Mr. Hainrich. Not at all, Elisa. It's all thanks to you. We wouldn't have made it in time, that's for certain. I must say, I'm curious to learn more about... None of that matters, Ludwig. Tonight's for celebrating. I won't hear another word about that nonsense. I don't think I'll be staying for long, anyhow. Drink up, drink up, both of you. Elisa is much too young to drink, Hainrich. Why, how old are you again, Elisa? I'm 18, Mr. Hainrich. I turned 19 this year. There you go, Ludwig. She can handle a glass or two, I'm certain. Uh, maybe some other day, Mr. Hainrich. You hear that? She's 18, artists. Oh, I thought I'd never see you again, lass. I always planned on coming back, Mr. Odelia. There's no need to say that. There's no need to say that, Miss Odelia. We're glad you're safe and sound, Elisa, both of you. I must say, I'm surprised you found him, Elisa. Those woods go on forever. It wasn't easy, I suppose. You suppose? Oh, but did you see her, Elisa? Miss Odelia. Always with that wretched witch on your mind, aren't you? We're here to celebrate, not waste our time with this nonsense. Atta girl, Lisa. All of Keeperberg is in your debt, lass. Lord knows what could have happened had it not been for you. I was lucky as all. No, Bernhard's right, Elisa. I owe you an apology. What matters if the apple is safe and sound? That said, Gustav, we best learn from this ordeal. We mustn't leave Kieferberg to the women again, that's true. I'd say the women handled it rather well, father. She's got you there, old lad. If not for me, I'm certain the others will have ventured out to find them. That's for certain. Marlin wouldn't have waited long either. Freya was getting ready to follow right after you, Lisa. They were gathering to head out when you when we arrived. We are fortunate to have you, Lisa. Enough talk, let's celebrate. 
Why don't you grab some ale and go grab Freya for a dance, Elisa? Uh, yes. All of Kieferberg's in your debt, lass. It's the least I could have done, if I'm honest. Truly, it could have been much worse. I feared for Jacob, too. Is he alright, Miss Marlin? He's home with Linda. It took a lot of effort to settle him for bed. Even after you came back, Elisa. I see. It's best we never head out on patrol all uh, at the same time again. Truly, this could have been avoided. It's best we pay poor Lisbeth a visit before we settle in. I wouldn't be able to sleep not knowing how she's doing. I'll go with you, Jacob. Oh wait, I'll go with you. Jacob will know how Abel, uh is alright. There is our lass. I'm so glad to see you're alright, my dear. You must have been so frightened, poor thing. The woods aren't the most inviting, that's for certain. We're fortunate the lad wasn't taken by the witch, that's all. This is the time to celebrate, old lad. Old Wilhelm's right. We have to be glad nothing happened. Apple didn't speak of such things, that's for certain. And I certainly didn't see anything, of course. That's a lie. <laughs> There's no need to justify yourself, Elisa. Make the most of your night, you hear? Atta girl, Elisa. I couldn't have done better myself, lass. You two have quite a bit of ale, haven't you? What better occasion? What better occasion could we have to celebrate? The festival is only a couple days away, Mr. Guido. This is better than the festival, Elisa. A great deal better, indeed. I trust you with my baby's life, lass. Oh, that's. You're a hero, Elise. No other way to put it. You can't leave Kieferberg now, can you? We're drinking to Elisa tonight. Drinking to Elisa tonight, we are. Oh, it must have been so frightening, Elisa. I'd say it was more frightening for Apfel. It's one thing after another with him, isn't it? How is he, Elisa? He seemed a little dazed, if I'm honest. No wonder the poor lad... No wonder, the poor lad was lost in the woods for hours. Oh, I'll stop by Miss Lisbeth's first thing in the morning. She must be exhausted. I can't let Abdel speak of what we saw in the woods. I'd wager you're, uh, you're as exhausted as Abdel, Elisa. I won't stay for long, Miss Ariane. Uh, we ought to celebrate while we can then. Why don't we all have some ale? Can't say my mind is in the right place to celebrate. I best figure out what to do about that testament. I'm feeling awfully restless, aren't I? It seems I won't be able to settle down before I see to that testament. I don't like to admit it, but old Gyochen's not wrong. If that thing was the witch, then... There's so much on my mind I can't celebrate. I'd be a lot happier if it weren't for what I saw in those woods. Anyhow, I'd best go take a look at that windmill. Windmill? It's best I don't expand too much on this story. Best I keep my distance. There you are, Elise. The girl of the hour. Are you alright, Mr. Eugen? 
Not you too, Elisa. A man has to make the most of what he's got left. Don't tell me ale is, ale is all you, you've got, Mr. Eugen. Why do you take this, Elisa? He just gives me the key. The key? I won't be needing that where I'm going, that's for certain. Mr. Eugen. You be careful, Elisa. These folks aren't to be trusted. Blaming the witch for what happened to my horses. They're all in on it, that's what. I can't very well tell them it was... It really was the witch, can I? Give her bird this, give her bird that. You're the only one in town who's not enamored with this rat hole of a town, Elisa. Ah, I suppose. Get away while you can. Unless this place ruins you like it's ruined me. Mr. Eugen's right. I must do this. I'll head up to that windmill and get this over with. There's a safe that wasn't there before. A workbench sits outside, typically used by the townsfolk of Kieferberg to bag newly milled flour. No, I want to I want to save. Can I please save? I have to get in there and get this over with. the crows and there's a golden one too Murim, that's what it's called you've come you've come uh, the gift lass the tender flesh I've come here to do just that you wretch show it to me show it to me your ardor your longing for that wish of yours I've already been to your grove. I've cleared your trial. What else is it you want from me? Your commitment. Your commitment. Show it to me, lassie. Your commitment. Oh. Chop. And kick. Hold up. Is this like the the wood chopping mini game? It is. And one. Wait. Okay, no, no, no. Fuck! Oh god, here I actually have limited life. Uh, what happened to Apple Boy? Uh, a lot. Um, wait, what? Hold on. What? This is different.
Um, uh, prevail against the crow. By the way, how are you? I'm doing good. Also, hi, Zitro. Welcome back. Got the tender flesh. Nuts. That crow. It's gone. One tender flesh. Maybe I should have died to see how it would have... What would have happened. It's got my hair in it. It'll do, I suppose. It's best I get out of here. The sooner the better. Oh. When did I... It's that dream again. But I was in town just now. Also, I found out it's apparently Lep Ku Hen, not Lep Ku Chen, so... I'm st I, I still have not gotten used to that. You again? Didn't you hear me? We'll be late for his banquet if you don't hurry. If you don't hurry. Banquet? What are you... Here comes the... the nice song. It's morning already? I don't feel like I got any sleep at all. Uh. It's best I go find those in Marina. Wait. Go back up. I'm begging you, Froke. What's going on there? What's going on out there? Wait, first, go back up. So the crying unicorn? Did it always look like this? It did not. What is the mystery behind that? I feel like it's like an endgame thing. Oh, please stay put, Froke. What's going into him? Ah, uh, Elise. She's throwing a temper tantrum is all. I didn't know goats could do such a thing. I had my hands full with breakfast. I couldn't give him much attention. It's what you get for spoiling him so much. That's what. I know, but I can't resist his sweet little hops. You're truly... Are you feeling better today, Eliza? You still haven't told me about what happened. I can't tell her the full extent of it, can I? Not about what I saw in the woods, or about her. Uh, what are you working on now? In the game, I mean. 
Good morning. Uh, good morning, Queen Mountain. Uh, what am I working on? Uh, I just saved uh, Apple Boy, as you call them. Uh, I don't know. I'm I'm literally in the same like route as I was. Um, I'm just trying to get an ending, really. <laughs> That's. I got to see what happens when like the suspicion gets like full. Are you listening, Elisa? What? Oh, wrong button. Huh? You were telling me about the woods. Apfel got lost in the woods, that's all. I went in there to rescue him, I suppose. You're not telling me the whole truth, are you? There is someone in those woods, Rosa Maria. I don't know who they are or what they want from me, but I felt their presence there since Monday. Someone in the woodland, you say? I'm certain they heard Apfel or lured them in, even. Please stay alive. I'll check in later. Just wanted to say good morning. Uh, now I don't want to stay alive. <laughs> Have you seen that old hag again, Elisa? The one who told you about him and the testaments? I haven't seen that old hag since then, but... That Rosa and Marina I met in the woods. I don't know what to make of any of this, do I? It is a... Come, Rosa and Marina, we should move along. Oh, it's best you go, you go ahead without me, Elisa. I think I'd best find Flock here, but... It's best I find Flocke. I'll be right there with you. Alright. Oh, I'd best go chase after Flocke. I didn't see where he ran off to, did you? Uh, that's alright, Elisa. I'll lure him over a carrot or two, you'll see. I only hope he hasn't wandered into town. I'll find him. You'll see. Da, da, da. I mean, at least I don't have to worry about her being in town. His gift does sue you rather well, lass. I was wondering when the snake was gonna show up. Those shoes... They'll guide you to him. Who are you? You know who I am, Irise. You're with him, just like that crow. You're quite smart, aren't you? This is another one of his trials, I take it. Why, yes. You're truly so delightful, lass. Fortune. That's what you're after, is it? You've come to taunt me, I'm assuming? I've come to welcome you into my very own garden, Elise. You alone, lass. I won't let that wretched thing into my grove. Unlike... What was his name again? Um... What was it? Mivrim? Oh, let me... Well done. I think it was... Murim. There we go. You alone, lass. I won't let that wretched thing into my grove unlike Murim, that fool. The testament you seek rests deep within my depths, Elisa. Am I to meet you there, then? My, how willful you are. You're trying my patience, that's what. We both know what I'm after, Serpent, so get it over with and...
You're now the bearer of my hex, lassie. Fated to meet me in my realm. Show me your resolve, your burning desire for more. Be good. Behave, Edisa, and I'll welcome you with open arms. You sickening wretch. I'll be waiting. I'll be awaiting you by the gates of my bed. I'll be awaiting you by the gates of my bedwood forest of berries, Elisa. What a cool guy. What the hell with you? Ugh, this stings. It's best I don't alarm Rosa Marina. I have to prepare myself for tonight. I must see this through. I'm so close to reaching his blessing. If what that crow and that serpent said is true, then I have no choice but to keep going for my own sake. Almost completely out of save files. You know what? I'm curious. I'm curious, right? So if I can I seriously not? I can't skip. Okay. I kind of like the name Murim. Kind of sounds like Meruem. Why was it all the way up there? Oh, okay, that's disappointing. Um. Oh, there we go. Nice. All by your lonesome today, Elisa? My cousin's taking a little longer to get ready today is all. Oh, I'm so glad you're getting along, dearie. You could use the company. Why doesn't she stay here in Kieferberg? Uh, I'm not too certain about that, Granny Gretel. Say it, he said. There's a favor I'd like to ask you. Wouldn't you keep an eye on Lepkuhem for me today? Is she sick, or... She wasn't feeling her best this morning, yet insisted on going to church. That Lepkuhem. You go give her a proper earful for me, will you? Will do, Granny. I'll have a good word with Lepkuhan. She can't keep going like this. Oh, hi. I wouldn't want to be a burden, Freya. Not at all, Miss Elizabeth. It would be my pleasure. Ah, good morning, Elisa. Is everything alright? Oh, I was inviting Miss Elizabeth and the children for dinner. I don't think we're ready for that yet, my dear. Well, the invitation stands, Miss Elizabeth. 
You're welcome anytime you'd like. How's that feel, Miss Elizabeth? Oh, Elisa, I have so many questions. He hasn't slept. He... He keeps mentioning the witch. The witch? What happened in the woods, Elisa? I didn't see anything resembling a witch, that's for certain. I feel still frightened, Miss Elizabeth. My apologies, Elisa. It wasn't my intention to insinuate. That's alright, Miss Elizabeth. I know you meant no harm. Oh, I hope nothing else happens today. Oh, I feel like I'm losing my mind. I'm about to be gone for a few hours. Alright, have fun. We have to stay strong, Miss Marielle. What happened, Mr. Guido? <sighs> Haven't you heard, Elisa? The windmill was ransacked, even though the door was locked shut all night. Huh? I don't want to think about it, if I'm honest. Could have been one of us folks, too. Or even the witch. Oh, don't say that, Guido. These folks are losing their minds. I can only hope they don't turn on me. Elisa, dear, are you listening? Hmm, what? Still tired from yesterday? It's best we don't chew it over too much, I'd say. Keeping our mouths shut won't make it go away, Brunhilde. Here to learn Nebuchadnezzar a hand, lass? What are you talking about, Mr. Wilhelm? Haven't you heard? Folks are gathering like bees inside that church. Because of the windmill and the grain? Precisely. Folks are going crazy. Some say it was the witch, others say it was the devil himself. Wait, Mr. Wilhelm. What does any of this have to do with Lebkuhan? Ah, it's best you go see for yourself, lass. Oh, I'm glad I had a word with Lebkuhan this morning. You folks are completely losing your mind. They certainly are, Miss Matilda. Elisa! This is to be taken seriously. My. I wouldn't want to blame poor Eugen, but... You best not say it, Matilda. This is a matter to be handled by Father Hans. Whatever it is, I don't think it's anything to fret about. How can you say such a thing, lass? Let's try to keep our composure, ladies. Miss Odelia is right. We best wait for Father Hans' ju judgment. Almost done with the week. So, um, what about the windmill? I suppose I won't be getting in there anytime soon, huh? Da -da -da -da.
We've got to clear out the blockage, folks. It's the only way. If you say so, lad. What's wrong with the fountain? It's one thing after another, isn't it, Elisa? We think the fountain's obstructed, is all. This is all her doing. The witch. She's taken our grain, our children, and now she's after our water. We've discussed this, old lad. Finn and I can give it a look, can't we, Finn? For the best of our ability, but... Old Wilhelm ought to know what's wrong with it. We're together here at noon, folks. I want to have a word with all of Kieferberg. You'll need me to lend a hand, Father. Naturally, Gustav. What are we to do about the grain, folks? The grain? You haven't heard, Les? No, I'm yet to fully understand what's going on. Someone was in the windmill last night, Elisa. It could have been the wind, or the crows, still. The door was still locked this morning, lad. It was Eugen's responsibility, but... It was the witch, I tell you. Give it a rest, old Yochen. It was you who left home early last night, Elisa. Wait, I was told you left home early last night, Elisa. She was certainly tired, old Yochen. Don't be unreasonable. It couldn't have been one of us, folks. What about the weevils? Weevils, Mr. Ludwig? The flour and grain uh, we had stored away are riddled with beetles, Lisa. I'm not certain... I'm not certain what we're to do with this grain now. All we can do is throwing it... All we can do to avoid throwing... Fuck's sake. I ain't doing tea. All we can do to, to avoid throwing it out, Ludwig. We'll become completely reliant on Primaldorf at this rate. That witch has us at her mercy. She has all of Kieferberg in the palm of her hand, and... That's enough, folks. I've heard enough. Finn and Heinrich will take a look at the fountain later. As for the rest of us, we ought to air out that grain and do away with those beetles, starting right now. This is only riling fo folks up even more. I'd best go see if Lebkuhen is alright. Cokes must be swarming her. Let me go see that fountain real quick. Because I think that was the cue to saying like, Hey, you can do something with this fountain now. There it is. The washing well is empty. That note and that key. Whoever's been doing those rituals may have tampered with this faucet. It fit. What in the Lord's name is going on in Kif Kieferberg? Another one of these caves. I'm starting to feel queasy again. I have to... I ought to pull myself together and get this over with. Wait, actually, before I do, let me go save.
I see how it works, so... Five matches, alright. I see how it goes, so it's... First... Third... Wait, no. First, fourth... Third, second. So it's this one here, this one here, this one here, this one here, this one here. Did I do it wrong? Or is it supposed to be from? Down, did I not do this right? Diary entry 4? Did I skip one? This was ripped out of some journal. Most of this was jotted down in a hurry, but... Walpurga, the witch. I've uncovered her roots at last. Everything points back to Kieferberg, the birthplace of the witch, Walpurga and her cult. This can't be... If there truly is a witch in Kieferberg, then... Adored and celebrated for centuries. The woodland surrounding this town was said to have consciousness of its own. This consciousness is what we now call a witch named Walpurga. Folks... Folks' faith in... In its miracles... Dates from many years before the glory of the church reached, reached these peaks. Said to grant its believers a good health sustenance and protection, the woodland, or Walpurga, harbored folks' wills, wishes, desires, and sins. In such a way, in fact, that it would appear to folks that it would appear to folks under the grease of a woman, whisper to the faithful, take the form of their loved ones, of an old hag, of a doe, amongst others. The six-ringed maypole, the symbol of St. Walpurga's benevolence we adore today. I was first adore as the symbol of the witch's miracles and mercy. That is no more, however. St. Walpurga is a patroness of the church, a benevolent figure in our faith. With the arrival of the Lord's messengers to these peaks, the cult of Walpurga was eradicated. It is fact, however, that the few who lived have become nomads of sorts. What is most puzzling to me is that my research and all of this history, it doesn't quite align with Old Hull's confession. While Perga the Witch never once, never once was said to ask anything in return for its blessing. Neither of was it ever referred to as a god or a male deity, rather a woman? How could a he have granted old holes a old hole a wish? This witch. How could a pagan de deity do what the Lord himself won't? I am fairly certain there is more to old holes old holes sins than meets the eye. Granny Hole sins, he says. Now if this is true, Father Hans is losing his wits. Granny Hole would never... She wouldn't never hide anything from me. The 
path ends here. But it looks to me like it like it caved in. I wonder if this used to connect somewhere. Did I do this right? I don't know if I did. I don't have anything to to fix this, do I? No, I do not. Um... Um... Can I help you, darling? I'm selling... This rosary. That it only sells for 30. For fuck's sake. Better than nothing, I guess. Um... Alright. Alright. I'm gonna... Gonna BRB real quick. I'll be right back in a few minutes.
I'm back. I made myself some tea. Alright. Cool. Alright, let's continue. Um now the problem is that now we have these whispers just in my head for the whole day. Because I have I have no items to and there aren't any tasks are there. Well guess we're just gonna have to deal with them. Will they get annoying? Absolutely. They already are starting to get annoying. Like, they probably shouldn't have made it so that, like... Like, these are just everywhere. Like, I get having them in a place where, like... Where you can die any minute. That makes sense. But... Having them just in town, that just seems like excessive. Please try to keep calm, Miss Linda. Oh, I know, I know. You don't have to look at my rosary, Lep. Uh, wait, won't you have to look at my rosary, Lepkuchen? Lepkuchen? I seem to have pulled on it a little too tightly this morning. That's no good, Ariane. No good at all. I'll tighten it for you, Miss Ariane. But first, I ought to. I can help, Leb Lebkuhen. Ah, Elisa. What are you saying, Lassie? A maid of all work can't possibly pray our blessings. We need Lebkuhen. Uh, where is Father Hans when we need him most? Other Hans has his own matters to attend to. I can... It's best you visit each and every one of our homes, Lebkuhen. Ah, that's... My inn, too. I'll need a prayer in... I'll need a prayer in each and every room before sunset. But before then, Lebkuhen, could you... Will you folks back off a little? My, Elise. Can't you see we're... <gasps> Debkuhen. Who's going to pray our blessings now? We must fetch Father Hands. Someone get her some water. Can you hear me? <laughs> I'll be taking her home, Elisa. She'll be fine. Mm. Alright, Mr. Othea. Why don't you pay her a visit in a little while? Of course, I'll be there. I ought to see her. She didn't deserve any of this. Uh... Chickens, apples. Let's do the chickens. Um, <laughs> Turkey long enough, it was a marina. Ah, Elise, I finally got Froke to settle down in the granary. More importantly, Rosa Marina. We have to be rather careful about town today. Folks are losing their minds. I heard something happened to the fountain, but stay close to me, you hear? Alright, Lisa. Folks are more are more than willing to believe there's a witch now, Rosen Rosen Marina. If we're not careful, they'll turn against us. You seem frightened, Elisa. 
have good reasons to be frightened, Rosa Marina. Not only for my own sake, either. Oh, you're so silly, Elisa. Huh? You don't have to worry about me. I wasn't. It's not like... Look at you. You've gone bright red. Oh, uh, for goodness sake. See? I see. I'll call for you if I need help, alright? I'll be here, Lisa. Um... Blood scr oh, it was right there. Did they really need to keep it, like, everywhere you go? Quickly, Lisa. When you, uh, when you pick me some apples? What's the rush, Miss Marlin? Why, with all that's going on, lass, Lord knows if we even have an orchid tomorrow. I'd say that's a bit of an overreaction, but it doesn't matter, Elisa. Please be quick about it. Shit, wait. That's gonna kill me. I wanna go back. How many apples these folks need, anyhow? Hey, 69, nice. I ended with 69, that's perfect. Look at that. Score of 69. It's ruined now, but. Forty-two rank A, nice. Try again? No, I'm good. Oh, I'm so glad you made it, Lisa. Thank you for your time today. She really doesn't seem to be doing so well. I don't wonder too much. What do you mean? Fucking get. Mm. Not that we're all gathered here, folks. Folks. Oh, we're losing our minds, Father. <sighs> this week hasn't been easy for Kieferberg, as we all know. That said, we have decided to ask Primaldor for support. Primaldor, you say? We cannot compromise the festival at all, as you understand. 
Are you certain we've considered every option, Father? Keeperberg isn't what it once was, Lud Ludwig. We need their help. We will be patrolling the outskirts in the evenings as well. That should make sleep easier, that's for certain. The protection of Kieferberg and our neighbors is in order, folks. What happened to poor Apfel? Wait, what happened to poor Apfel was bad enough. Oh, Father. But who is to carry our nightly prayers? Naturally, the church's doors will open to all regardless. What about the windmill and the fountain? There's still water in the well. Well, but no need to fret. Oh, but who knows how long that well will last. It's not as though that fountain's sustaining the well, is it? What would you know, Lassie? I'm at a loss regarding the fountain, if I'm honest. Wasn't there some sort of blockage, Mr. Ludwig? We're going to have to disassemble it. Why doesn't she try it, Finn? With those toothpick fingers of hers, I'd say she'd get the job done rather easily. This isn't the time to provoke the last Wilma. She's so keen to stick her nose in everything, Ludwig. Might as well teach her a little lesson, wouldn't you say? Let's not get carried away, Wilma. We're not here to... Why, that's a terrific idea. Elise, that's dangerous. You'll get hurt. Oh dear lord. Oh dear lord. She's getting in there. I'll show you all. A snake. A black snake was in the fountain. Oh, Kiefenberg is down is done for. The witch. It's the witch. The devil himself. We can't lose our heads. We must remain calm, you folk. We, we must remain calm. You folks can't... Calm? How are we to remain calm, father? <sighs> Everyone's dismissed. Back to work. Gustav and I will have a word about this. Also, current those in mind at the windmill fray at her house. Shit. Alright, I need to buy Samuel Perkins oil. Buy. I don't have enough of this. Can I sell anything? I mean, at least I, I have bread. Um, and bandages. Please just shut up. Two seconds. Shut up. I'm glad to see there's some cheer left in you, Lisbeth. I have much to thank you for, Miss Marielle. You do look better, Miss Elizabeth. We spent a couple of hours at Miss Marielle's, you see. I knew you could use some time away from these goings-on. I must say, however, I'm a little fearful myself, too. You, Miss Marielle? Folks are losing their wits, Elisa. 
We were suing for the festival, and even then, every conversation led back to the crows or Apfel or the fountain. I see. Thinking ill of each other, uh, accusing each other. We just about had it. This bitch. Don't let it get to you, Elisa. Let what get to me, Miss Ariane? Why, this what not about the snake and the witch and whatnot. Wait, this nonsense about the snake and the witch and whatnot. Wait, how did, why did I... How did I read that? So badly. Folks can't get enough of it. And then even I'm starting to believe it. I wouldn't say I believe it, Elisa, but it's complicated. You understand, don't you? I suppose I do, Miss Ariane. What do you want, you fucking bitch? Konogaki! Hey, I have an offer for you, Elisa. Out of my sight, Martha. I've had enough trouble for one day. Oh, but I think you'd like to hear this. I would have done. I don't have all day. Ah, uh, but it wouldn't be for free. How about you give me some soup? Why, I don't think so, Muffs. We had an uh, agreement, Elisa. Out of my sight, Mary. I don't care what it is you have to tell me. Go away. You'll regret it, Elisa. Will I now? Very much so. I'll tell every folk in town, you and your cousin. Tell them, then. I won't if you give me some apple strudel tomorrow. Go tell them whatever you want, how many times you want, to whoever you want, Mandy. I want you out of my sight. Nelly's interference can weigh quite heavy. Can weigh quite heavy. I'd best be prepared for tomorrow. I still have, I think, two days left? Yeah, two days left. Yes. It's cruel, I tell you. That's all this is. What's cruel, Mr. Hainrich? Blaming Eugen for what happened to the windmill, lass. I must confess, I'd rather... I'd rather it be a witch than a neighbor. Now, I wouldn't go that far, but Eugen wouldn't... You, Mr. Hainrich? That serpent you pulled out of the fountain, Elisa. Folks couldn't do such a thing. Wouldn't you say it crawled into the fountain by itself? Not likely. Whatever is happening in Kiefenberg, it's starting to compromise our livelihood, and we can't have that. We must make the most of those patrols, that's what. Ah, Elisa, I was looking for you, dearie. Looking for me, Miss Matilda? You see, I was hoping you'd have a word with Ariane. I've been struggling quite a bit lately, you see. Struggling with what, Miss Matilda? Oh, it's rather embarrassing, but I can no longer do many of my house chores. This terrible tremor won't let me wash my dishes or my laundry. Miss Matilda, will you tell her I need to stop by tonight, Elisa? I would tell her myself, but... Uh... But this would be the fourth time this week, you see. Of course, Miss Matilda. I'll let her know. There she is. Fuck, wait. Come on now, Adelia. There's hardly any need for that howling. 
I'm surprised you're not on her side about this, Miss Bertha. Odelia's convinced... Odelia's convinced you conjured up that serpent, Elisa. We all saw our very eyes, Bertha. We saw nothing of the sort. Elisa might very well be the witch for all we know. Why, you... That said, we can't point fingers at everyone in town, Odelia. Punishing all of Kieferberg out of fear isn't the answer. Oh, good lord. We're done for. I can't even have a word with Lebkuhen, either. Because you folks hounded her day and night. Leave Odelia to me, Elisa. Kieferberg will be done for if we carry on like this. Who is Ariane again? We ought to search Kiefenberg from top to bottom, I say. I'm not sure I agree, old Yochen. I share your concerns, Mr. Ludwig. I'm certain that serpent simply crawled into the fountain. Can you see what's transpiring here, you fool? No, I don't think we can, old Yochen. We're the only fool here. I don't think we can. Everyone else is fretful, of course, but you're the one causing such an uproar. I suppose that snake you pulled out of the fountain didn't help, Elisa. As if that's my fault, Mr. Ludwig. I wouldn't put it past you, lass. Lord knows the witches... Blindly accusing folks won't get us anywhere, old Yochen. You'll see, you fools. No, I don't think we will be seeing much of anything, old Yochen. You must keep calm, lest Kieferberg catches on, f catches on fire. Suspicion down, yes. Fuck you, Muppet. I need to get it down once more, though. This isn't enough. Some way, I can't do that right now. Miss McTilda used to be so energetic, too. Who is Ariane? What's up? But weren't you two? Uh, wait, hold the fuck up. It's just as Mr. Lyle said, this old fool's hoping for the wish to show up. But wait, they're in two places at once. Hold up. I can't go to you right now. I'm sorry, Freya. Your best girl and all, but... I gotta... I gotta find, uh, what, what is her name? Not here. Actually, now that I think about it... Oh! Wait a minute. Uh... You know, I was thinking about this, but... I'm not supposed to have this, am I? <laughs> Wait... <laughs> Wait... Um... So, um... I don't think that that's thought of that. <laughs> um, I I guess I just have this now. Okay, sure. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Hold on, where's Ariane? <laughs> uh, I just duplicated uh, the item. <laughs> Oops. Unless you're supposed to keep it afterwards, which I don't think that's true.
That absolutely will not do, Gustav. Woman's right. What we all need is someone to... What are you two pestering Mr. Gustav for? They're all valid concern, ladies, but I ought to say... No, I don't think you understand, Gustav. We must make certain there is no witch in Kieferberg. I have a suggestion, Mr. Elma. Does if that change anything? I have a suggestion. We throw folks off the cliff, see if they fly or not. Very funny, Elisa. The last is right, ladies. We must be reasonable here. Things can only get worse if we don't act now, Gustav. Things could get better too, Miss Elma. Oh, all you want is to be Gustav's good book, lassie. All I want, Miss Wilma, is some peace and quiet around here for once. That's why we must find the witch, lass. Good grief. Suspicion down, yes. It's good Miss Marielle still uh, got it all together, huh? Wait. You? Ah, Miss Ariane, I was meaning to ask you. There she is. It's Miss Mac Is it Miss Matilda? She said she needs you to help her out again tonight, yes. The poor thing. Old age. Old age truly doesn't forgive, does it? When did this start, Miss Ariane? Oh, just last week, Elisa. I caught her trying to wash her sheets by the well, you see. She could have asked me. Miss Matilda's rather stubborn, you know you know that. Tell her I'll be there right after supper. Alright, Miss Ariane. Even they're starting to consider the switch nonsense. Did you find her, Elisa? Miss Ariane said she'll come by right after supper, Miss Matilda. Thank you, Elisa. Here's something for you. Silk purse. You don't have to, Miss Matilda. Oh, it's the least I can do, my dear. There will come a day when I truly won't be able to do anything after all. Miss Matilda. Is this something I can sell? Pretty, you know, not the nicest thing to do, like selling, like a gift, but yeah, I guess that's cool. Hey, baby girl, I'm back. Does this sell just as much as the fucking worn out purse? Maybe I should get a Levkuhan. Not the character, the... Um, the food. Um... What was I want? I, I wanted to check something. Right, my health. Yeah, I probably should get like a Levkuhan. No way, I didn't want to sell. Um, I want to buy. Look on. No, I love pretzels, but unfortunately they're not. I 
I just noticed. I'm a fucking idiot. It only kills three food bars. It doesn't actually heal, like, health. Um, well. Too late. <laughs> That's fine. Um, I mean, I needed it anyway. In fact... In fact, I'm gonna need it to get that, that dumbass. Yeah, to get that dumbass into, uh, like, in for work. That was my last cup of tea. Damn it. <laughs> there she is. Spend some time with her. <laughs> You were right, Elise. It really is a lovely view. You've seen better on your travels, I wager. Oh, but Kieferberg is one of the nicest towns I've been to. You're trying to vex me, are you? Oh, I didn't mean to. I know you didn't, Rosa Marina. I'm fed up with it as well. Kieferberg? With all this nonsense we're dealing with, too. That said, I still haven't made up my mind about leaving it all behind somehow. I'm going to such lengths, and yet... I'd say doubting yourself is a good thing. You're different, Rosa Marina. You've always had something to look forward to while I... Even so, Ediza. I find myself thinking about certain things living here with you. Such as? How I wish I'd found you sooner and have the chance to share memories with you. Just the way Lebkuen and Freya do. You've only, be You've only been here for a few days, Rosa and Marina. Had you been born in here, you'd be just as sick of it as I am. I suppose, but... I've never lived in a town. This sense of community is something I've never experienced. I've lived here all my life and I never experienced it either, Rosa Marina. Not since Granny Hall passed away, at least. Say, Rosa Marina, about the stars you keep mentioning. Hi. Ah, I can tell you all about it, Elisa. They've led you here of all places. Don't you find it strange? They've led you here of all places? To this rotten Kiefenberg. I've had enough of I've had enough of this conversation. I'm heading back to work. Shh. No. <laughs> No. Fuck! When did I last save? I don't even know. Um...
Wait, can I go down here? Uh, I don't think I can look into this with folks hanging about the well. So as I come back some other time. Yep, yeah, alright. Interesting. Sell this again. The silk purse. Then. Then what are you buying? I think it's best, uh, I think it is best to get the, the lead to him. Actually, not that I think, but I haven't talked to this fucker yet. Do you have a moment, Elisa? Certainly, father. I'd like to ask you to go easier on folks. Easier, father? Practice. Patience. Uh, oh wait, practice patience, Elisa. Now more than ever. You pulling out that serpent this morning has upset some folks. I don't think that's fair, Father. How is that my responsibility? I don't think that's fair. Miss Wilma was the one who provoked me to do it in the first place. I understand, Elisa, but folks are restless. Today has been rather challenging, as you know. I hope you're having this conversation with Miss Odelia as well. Miss Bertha, Miss Brunhilde, and old Yochin too. Certainly, Elisa. Yes. Yeah, that nasty gaki can't stop me now. Alright. And by this. Oh, spend 500 Tiffle. Well, I've spent quite a lot, apparently. I didn't even know I spent that much. I thought I spent like 100 at, at most. Or like 200. Alright. Back to Rosa Marina. The first safe because fucking hell. Thank you. 
Oh god. And some time. find it strange all this nonsense about your fate being with me not at all Elisa I said it before I feel like you feel like home to me not at all huh I do wish I was born here if I'm entirely honest I've come all this way and our paths have finally crossed yet me too Rosa Marina I feel at home with you like I've known you for a long time I must say, Kieferberg isn't as bad with you around. Wouldn't you give me your hand? You've read it once already, haven't you? It could be more thorough. It may bring you some some it may bring you some peace of mind. Alright, alright. Oh, it's the windmill. I was looking like below and I was like, wait, what is that like? flashing like color and then I realized we're on a windmill like we're next to a windmill you're my fitted soulmate Elisa you said that already I know you still don't quite believe me but my feelings for you are genuine Elisa you hardly know me Rosa Marina your feelings can't possibly be... Yet they are, Elisa. They're very much genuine. You're so embarrassing. I wish we had more time to get to know each other and... Even if this wasn't my fate, I could still choose to be with you, Elisa. Oh, Elisa, you're as red as a beet. Why you? I've had it with this nonsense. I'm heading back to work. Uh, wait for me, Elisa. Let's go to the creek tomorrow afternoon. I'll be there. Now hurry up. Strong bond. To five hearts with someone. But there's six hearts in total. <laughs> Not that. <laughs> Alright, so... Chop some wood, apples. I think I'll do the wood. No, well, I don't mind doing apples either, actually. Ah, uh, Elisa. What's the matter, does it, Marina? Folks have been looking at me all day, is all. You don't think they know. They don't know anything, Rosen Marina. You can't forget you're still a stranger to Kieferberg. I don't remember getting all these looks on Monday, Elisa. They're worried because of what happened today is all. I suppose. There she is, Apfel. Why don't you ask her? Ask me what? Apfel is going over what happened yesterday, Elisa. He's rather tired and... You saw her too, Elisa. I know it. Who did you see, Apfel? I didn't see anyone, Apfel. Oh, Elisa. What are we to do about this? I saw her. She had yellow eyes and I... You're tired, Apfel. I know it was frightening. I was frightened too. Elisa's right, Apfel. It's best you rest now. Why don't you go play with Gruna and Jacob?
So I think Capville saw her too. You hear me, Atlas? Pick some apples for me. That's all right, Atlas. Don't fret. Not if you change your mind. All right. Let's keep calm, folks. Losing our tempers isn't going to fix anything. What the fuck happened here? I just realized the fountain is completely, like, overflowing. What's wrong with the fountain now? Could you have damaged it earlier, Lisa? That could very much be the case. I don't think so, but... Even if she had, it wouldn't be enough to cause this. What are we to make of this then, Heinrich? How am I sup How am I to do such a thing? It's not only the fountain either. The well is also... The well? It's overflowing, Elisa. How can a well overflow? I'm at a complete loss. Let us wait and see. Why, I'm not about to sit and wait for my home to be flooded. I must say I don't agree, Father. It might be all we can do. Yellow fellow, hello eggs, how you doing? It truly is all we can do, Heinrich. Losing our minds won't help. We must press. We must persevere. This isn't looking too good for us here, Kieferberg. For us here in Kieferberg, is it? Let me save. Yes. I mean yellow? Oh, okay. Hello to you. How you doing? That's what it's all about, I tell you. There's no such ill will in Kieferberg, Wilma. What's the matter? Oh, I'm certain he has something to do with it. Wilma's convinced some someone's trying to sabotage her in, Elisa. It's that Eugen, I'm certain. Red, green, yellow. Uh, there's no yellow. Oh wait, there is yellow on me. Never mind. I have more yellow than than red on me. Shit. My shirt is yellow, or like it has like a yellow stripes. Damn it. <laughs> He's jealous. My business is still up and running. That's what, Mr. Eugen. Are you aware of what you're saying, Miss Wilma? Clearly not, Elisa. Wilma's letting it all get- letting all this get to her. Aren't we all, Marlin? I said yellow, you're green, but your name is red. Yeah. <laughs> Too many colors, I tell you. Even for me. Mm. You foot what the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? Hold on. Why is the stream lagging? Is the stream lagging? I think it's fine now. Alright. You folks are too afraid to name names, that's what. It's a matter of respect, Wilma. Respect for whom? The witch? What are we to do then, Wilma? It's best I shut my mouth before they turn on me. Nice. Alright, um... What am I to do, Leb Kuhin? Give him time, Miss Lisbeth. Abfell's still struggling, is he? He's rather agitated, yes. 
That aside, Lisa, I've been mean to ask you. Abfell insists you two saw someone else in the woods. Alas, of all things. I'm tired of this question. I understand how he feels. If I'm entirely honest, I still haven't found my own peace of mind, but... Elisa, I didn't see what Abfell claims to have seen, but... Given how frightened he was, he could have imagined it. That's true, but... Oh, I can't bear seeing him like this. It's best we give him some some space, Miss Lisbeth. Alright, let's do the apple one. Let's help with the apples. Uh, might as well help where I can. You know, let me see if there's any, like, side missions. Just in case. But those might just be during the day. Old Yochin's still not going to waste his chance, I tell you. His chance to do what, Miss Lorelei? Why, find the witch, Elisa. I'm not certain where to trust his judgment, Lorelei. Father Hans isn't lifting a finger. Who else are we to rely on? Mr. Gustav, clearly. Anyone but old Yochen? Mr. Gustav, clearly. He's done more for Kiefenberg than Father Hans ever could. Gustav's struggling, however, as we all are. Yet, he's doing his best to keep Kieferberg together. The last is right. Still, neither Gustav nor Father Hans will chase that witch out of Kieferberg. What we need is someone who will. I'm not certain on Jotun's the one we need, Lorelei. We ought to trust Gustav. He'll find a way. Gustav is best man. Have fun, Mr. CH. That's not part of the name. That's just short for channel. I can't say I'm glad to hear that, lad. Hear what, Miss Elma? That I'm leaving, lass, for good. I thought you'd stay, Mr. Eugen. Don't think so, unfortunately. I would leave too if I were your age and with these goings on. You, Miss Alma? Kieferberg's changed, Elisa. Things were different back in my day. More prosperous. Primmeldorf has more to offer young folks. Has more to offer young folks, that's for certain. Who would have who would have thought? Wait, why are you here? Eek! E Elisa! Why are you hiding here, Miffy? You saw nothing. I'm not here. I'm at home sweeping, making the beds. Hiding from your aunt again, are you? Oh, please don't tell her I ran off. She's working me like a donkey, Elisa. Is that so? Sweeping, washing clothes, cleaning out the chimney. I've had it, Elisa. Miss Lorelai is always, has always been demanding, I suppose. She's not demanding, she's wicked. Wicked, you say? I do feel... I do feel for poor Melly sometimes. I don't. Fuck her. Yeah, the well has very much of a fun. Holy shit. How the fuck did that happen? <laughs> We're not dealing with, re with regular folk here. 
But what if it's not folk we're dealing with, Mr. Bernhard? Lord knows what could happen to Kieferberg at this rate. It's too much to keep track of, folks. The horses, Apfel, our grain being riddled with weevils, and now this flooding. I must say I'm at a loss my I might have lost myself. You, Mr. Gustav? All of Kieferberg is confused, Elisa. Rather than confused, I'd say... We're, that we're rather defeated. We're everything but defeated, Elisa. The last is right, Brunhilde. Now, I wouldn't say... Now, I wouldn't say she's right, Gustav. We've been slowly... Giving in to this witch, haven't, I, haven't we? Take inspiration from Elisa herself. Uh, I'm not sure I go that far, Mr. Gustav. She did rescue Apfel, that's for certain. We have much to learn from the last. You may be right, Gustav. We ought to stand strong. Oh. I like how I went from almost full to just... To, to almost nothing. Wow, I thought it was three. It's actually two suspicion. Damn. Ah, how glad I am to see you, Elisa. I must thank you for your hard work as always, lass. What do you mean, Miss, R Miss Marielle? Why, you're still working hard despite everything. Lord knows what would be of me if you stopped helping. I suppose. That said, Elisa, would you please get me some firewood? Of course. I'll be back in a moment then. Take your time, my dear. Yes. Can you give me some wood? <laughs> Thank you. Ha! Round two. Two. One. Go! I almost kicked that one. Fuck. Fuck. Fifty two. Rank S. God damn. I've never gotten a rank, an S rank before. Try again? No, no, I'm good. I was kind of hoping that would be different, but... Oh, you didn't have to go through all this trouble, Elisa. Well, I suppose your encouragement made it easier. Here you go, dearie. For your trouble. Wait, how much was that? Was that 50? I had 27, didn't I? So that was 60. Holy shit. You and Freya always do such a good job of... Of course we're all grateful. Not all, but I'll take it. Damn, I need to try getting S ranks more often. Fuck.
I'm buying. I need this roast turkey. Buy this. And while I'm at it, buy this too. Alright, so I... Oh wait, nothing to do currently? Can I not... Uh, I should save the moment I can. Do I not get the bread from... Dev Kuhem? Probably saves, alright. Are you joining the patrols, lass? Why would I, Mr. Wilhelm? Makes two of us then, I see. The lads won't let me go. The ingrates. Ingrates? I'm very much capable despite my age. Ah, I see. You too, Elisa. You've rescued the poor lad, and yet... If anyone should be out there, it'd be you. Speaking of which, Gustav, we ought to head on home, I'd wager. And don't dawdle, Elisa. Everyone wants to stay home this evening. Of course, Father. It's important to keep a good grasp on who's out and, who's out and about tonight. What do you mean, Mr. Gustav? We're taking turns on patrol, you see. We must make certain the same thing doesn't happen again. What happened with Apfel? I understand. Wait, what happened with that fell? I understand. That's why you and your cousin had best stay home, Elisa. Certainly, Mr. Gustav. This ordeal has been going on long enough. It's about time you do something, that's for certain. <laughs> Maybe Elisa could give it a try, Grune. Give what a try? Apfel won't talk to anyone about it. He won't eat, he won't sleep, he won't even talk to mommy. This can't be good. Do you think you can try talking to him, Elisa? Apfel says you saw it too, Elisa. Saw what? He said there was someone else in the woods. Alas, he didn't recognize. Alas? So you don't know anything about it, Elisa? Of course not. Don't be silly, Jacob. Apfel says he doesn't want to talk about it, but... That's alright, Grune. Granny Marlin said... He'll talk when he's ready. <laughs> Elisa, do you have a moment? For goodness sake. What now? You see, Elisa, we've been wondering. It's best we don't, Ariane. What's the matter? Your cousin was telling us about how she got to Kieferberg, you see. Is it true she came all this way on foot, Elisa? On foot, Miss Avelia? I don't recall. We wouldn't want to fret, but we thought that was very strange. Your cousin isn't being honest with you, lass. I'll be on my way home. I'll be on my way home now, ladies. Good night. No, 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 no. Hold on, no, no. Let me retry that one. I'm pretty sure I saved, right? Fairly sure. Yes, I did, okay.
Yes, it is. She couldn't afford to come about any other way, Miss Odelia. That's highly unlikely, Elisa. She wasn't very lucky, I suppose that's all there is to it. I'll be on my way home now, ladies. Good night. Lab! Lab! Food! Please! Why in the Lord's name are you doing out here, Lab Kuhan? Waiting for your earful, it seems. I would have met you inside, for goodness sake. I'm fine, Elise. You're making too much of it. Your bread. Thank you. You're out of your mind, Leb. Speaking of which, Elise, folks have been rather tense lately. I've noticed. I know you can look after yourself, but... One good deed won't show you from all of it, Elisa. What do you mean? Folks have been talking ill about each other all day. I... Even Miss Marielle hasn't been spared, you see. There's no need to fret, Leb. I'll make certain I'll hold my tongue. Make certain you stay home as well. Has she not noticed I've been wandering about at night? Elisa? Of course, Leb. And you need to stop fretting. We don't want you fainting again. I will in due time. It's best you head on home, Elisa, before it gets any darker. Where are you folks going? It's time we head out on patrol. We must make certain Kieferberg's uh, out of harm's way. Even if you say that, Ludwig. You've been going on these patrols all week, and yet... All the more reasons to keep doing it, lass. Finn's right. We need to look out for each other. All I want is to let them have it. Uh, be it the culprit or even the witch. Can't say I don't share the sentiment, Finn. At least... We managed to pick up those weevils somehow. I noticed you've managed to fix the fountain. I did not notice that. I actually completely overlooked that. That happened on its own. We don't know how. Oh, I wouldn't show... Oh, I wouldn't show the bastard. If only we knew who it is. Would they beat their own neighbors, I wonder? It is... Uh... Now what's gonna happen, actually? Not, I'm, I'm curious. I have dinner with Rogan Marina, even though I've, we haven't done that in like a couple of days, but sure. Snake? No. No snake. It is there. Welcome home. What's Froke doing inside Rose and Marina? Uh, I was about to take him out to the granary. Is everything alright, Lisa? Uh, I'm tired as all. I'm not sure I should mention that serpent. Talking to Rose and Marina sometimes does more harm than good. Uh, no. You're thinking of something, aren't you? 
I'll be heading out after supper, Rosa Marina. I was invited. Where to? By whom? By a serpent. Just the same as that crow. It invited me to its grove. Oh, that's wonderful, Elisa. I suppose... I'll be staying home this evening, if that's alright. Things didn't quite go well last time, did they? It was wrong of me to interfere. This is something you're to do for you and you alone. You're right. What is it, Froke? Can't you settle down? I'll take him outside, Elise. He's been a little restless. And then we can have supper. A little too restless for my liking. I can hardly think with that goat hopping about. Hey, don't you dare insult my boy Froke. Time to head to the woods. Wait, actually. Oh. Well, this is different. Very different, actually. It didn't used to look like this, did it? Five matches, cool. Oh, hello. Can you feel it, lass? My neck. It aches, doesn't it? That kiss of mine. You wretch, what did you do to me? You did well in finding me in these depths. What is this? Something's writhing. Come to me, lass. Sink deeper. I will give you no nothing less than what you seek. <gasps> My serpent's dangerous. I don't like it one bit. The 
received the snake's curse. I think I already had the snake's curse. Porcelain knife. I'd best think I'd best think twice before using this. Oh, that was needless damage. Okay, sure. I can't see shit. What is this? Another porcelain knife. Just think twice before using this. This gate's so heavy looking. I'm not strong enough to push it open. There's something on the other side, but how to get there? There we go. That's how. What in the? It moved. Ow. What? What happened? Huh? I can't see shit. Oh, uh... Well, I'm as dead as can be. Oh, god Let's use it here instead. Oh. Oh. Ah. Oh, how foolish I was to think he would have granted me all my heart. To think he would have granted me all my heart desires. He didn't. I faltered in my resolve, in my determination. If only I had taken that last step. Why didn't you? You will know in time. I suppose I will. Berries. Can I eat those? I can. And they recover one heart. Useless. It's a just an equal to the acorns to do nothing. I think what I gotta do is I gotta... No, not, not the berries. The knife. Use. Before I do that, let me just look around real quick. Because chances are I'm just missing something. Yeah, I'm back here. She faltered in her resolve, was it? Disturbed solely by the endless water stream, the moon's reflection grazes its surface in everlasting companionship.
This gate's so heavy looking. What? Strong enough to push it open. Wait, no, I'm not. Wait. I, I, uh. I'm safe. Whatever that thing is, it doesn't seem to follow me into solid ground. Um. It is waiting for me, just right there. Um, so I'm kind of seeing how it works, but also, uh, I don't really. This place is very different from that crow's realm, isn't it? Yeah, I actually prefer this place. Looks a lot nicer. I'm safe, but the thing is, it doesn't seem to follow me on solid ground. Oh. Wait, was that? Get out. What in the Lord's name was that noise? Lost in thought as it as it were, the statue's gaze loses itself in solemn contemplation. Hello there. I knew you'd show up sooner or later, lass. Why don't we get this over with, Serpent? Where's the testament you promised me? My, I don't see a need to rush. I'm already bearing... ...the sting of... I'm already bearing the sting of your bite, Serpent. What else is it you want from me? Oh wait, it was... It was her that said that. What, it, what else is it you want from me? You've received his gifts. His gift. Shared your flesh with that oath of a crow. It is now my own, my own turn to partake, lassie. It stings, does it? What did you do to me, you wretch? 
come find me on the farther on the farther side of these gates. Show me your resolve. Traverse these depths. Only then shall I give you what you want. Will you at least tell me your name, Serpent? It's Azriel. As Aziel. I think Azriel last. Wait, can I open these? Uh, no. This is such an odd lock. How am I... How am I to get it open, I wonder? It must be meant... It must be meant for some sort of key, but... For heaven's sake. I'll go mad if I stay here any longer. Hello there. I'm just right where I spawn, too. You're nice enough to not hide. You too will be bathed in gold, lass. All who meet him share the same fate. Did he not grant your wish? We golden maidens belong to him, lass. Regardless of whether it is you wish, uh, regardless of whether it is your wish he's granted or if you were gifted to him. What? I think I was once in your shoes. Gifted to him? Wait, she doesn't have eyes. Nebukuhin! That couldn't be her. Well, it was. Somehow. Come, lass. Your goodness is much needed. My goodness, you say? I know what you seek in these depths. That serpent's... The key to its burrow, yes. In this woodland, guarded by the masked beasts, is its second half. What about the first half? Make your way deeper into the lagoon. And I'll surrender it to you. What lagoon? Wait. For goodness sake. Ah. Uh, I don't think I was supposed to <laughs> do that. No! <laughs> um, can I please? It's shining so bright. I can't see what's at the bottom. Illuminated from its depths, the water surface blooms as the irid iridescent shades of teal waltz in its gentle undulation. Hmm. 
No, you fucking slut. Was this part of a, of a bigger statue, I wonder? Toppled upon a dense bush, the cracked stone statue rests eternally as it were in a peaceful slumber. I didn't mean to do that. Shit. Well, now I know. Yeah, look, she has like, she has no soul. I can't just skip this. I hate. I hate when you can't skip the fucking dialogue. Aww. Where's the fucking? These statues are everywhere, aren't they? Devoid of any traceable expression, the statue's hands rest cross across its chest in an elegant pose. What was that? Serpent key. This ought to be it. I'd best find the other one. With an interestful expression, the statue's hands are crossed in its chest in an elegant pose. What was that? Berries. Uh, wait, no. Go back. Wait. Was that the... This is where I came from, isn't it? Pretty sure, yeah. Interesting. Where's the lane knife? Alright. Berries again. Oh shit! He's fucking... What? Okay, sure. Wait. You again. Come, lass. You have to keep your word. I have my doubts as to whether you'll keep yours. Follow the moonlight, and you shall receive its graces. Follow the moonlight. Oh. It, I think the moonlight is following me. <laughs> No, I kind of want to explore. And clearly that was the right call.
What if I do follow the moonlight? Hmm, what if I don't? Lost in thought as it were, the statue's gaze loses itself in solemn contemplation. Wait, it has the yellow dialog box instead of the purple one? You've come to a rescue. Rescue? My other half has been shattered in three. Left to rot in these depths. I beg of you. Find the great statues. Uncover where they've kept my other half. You're giving me the other... Uh, you're giving me the other half of this key, surely. I'm not about to wander this lagoon with no purpose. I have what you seek, yes. Find my other half. Put us to rest and I shall aid you as well. You best keep your word. These moon phases. I wonder what they're for. They seem to be connected somehow. No. No. see shit. I, I still can't see shit. Three matches. Doing all that for three matches. Not exactly my greatest achievement. Must say. Oh. I see how this works. I think I'm starting to see it. there would be one in this room. I almost missed one. Cruel, aren't you? Huh? <coughs> Is your wish truly worth what you're sacrificing? I don't think that's any of your business. You've been branded already, haven't you? What's of all these questions? My, I'm just trying to tell you. I know I've made plenty. And so did the rest of us. Well, I have no intention of ending up like a lot of you. We'll meet again then. Sooner rather than later. For goodness sake. Is there seriously nothing here? Besides the maiden? Ok, 
Okay, hold on. So... I'm starting to kind of see, but I, I need to take a picture real quick. Or actually, no. I can just keep it paused right here. Alright, on the stream. Nice. And now I can check. Perhaps it's best to take a look uh, a look about this lagoon. The more I look at this slate, the more it reminds me of a map. Which... How? Where am I, where am I to find these great statues you speak of? Oh, I see. Wait, this it has like a triangle. Hmm. Their eyes shine red with. Kavesh. That you have. Go fuck yourself. Kavetuousness. Envious of living one. Uh, envious of living ones such as yourself. Their eyes shine red, you say. Yep, there's that moon. Uh, I found something. Uh, no, I haven't. Does this lead to anywhere? I guess so. Uh, nope. No, I remember being here. It's shining so bright. I can't see what's at the bottom. I'm just gonna go back up here. Just, you know. Uh, yeah, that didn't... That didn't go well. Okay, hold on, hold on. So... There should be the... It's a half moon. Oh, what's this? There we go. Take heed. Drowning in, eter drowning in eternally rushing waters. This is our fate. In limbo we remain, doomed to gaze up at the moon's eternal crescent. There- oh! There's the symbol. There we go. So that means... And now I go diagonally. Or... not? Maybe so. Hold on. No, don't, do, do not trigger that. Hold on. I am seeing, there it is. I found it. Take heed. 
One's path is nothing but the reflection of one's ungodliness. Only in the embrace of the new moon we may one purify their sins. I see. You do you, my guy. Ha! Oh, so this is the reflection the statue mentioned. I suppose I'd, I'd best to solve the other great statue's riddles. Wait. Hold on. So each statue has reflection? Like, so each statue has a riddle on top of having to be found? Oh boy. Okay. Oh, I found this one. Take heed. Pour all that is your passion into six vessels, lass. Pursue his blessing at the peak of luminescence. And you too shall drown in his allure. Six vessels at the peak of luminescence. I may have seen those before. I may have seen those before in this lagoon. Six vessels. I forgot what one of them was. Like, one of them said something about a reflection that I found by complete accident. And... Let's take a look about this lagoon. The one look at it more reminds me of a map. Well, I found them. Which one was this? Uh, this one is a reflection one, so I got this one. Rushing waters, huh? Oh, they'll have to do with statues. 
I suppose it'd be best to solve the other great statues riddles. Okay. Um, one was rushing waters, one was illuminating, and one was six vessels. Which is, I think, this one. No, this is the reflection statue mentioned. Okay, no, never mind. This is the reflection statue. Six vessels. No! No! No, you don't. No. Bad. Bad. You don't, you don't see me? Alright, cool. Just gives up. Six vessels. At the peak of luminescence. You may have seen those before. Oh, at the peak of luminescence. On peak of luminescence, is that the full moon, maybe? That's the snake. Oh, no you don't. Those things do so much damage, too. What the fuck? No, that's not the right, right one. Where's the full moon? Oh, it was the complete opposite way of where I went. Great. That's the rushing waters. No. Um. No. Peak of luminescence. Guessing it's around here somewhere. Oh, there we go. That vision. It's that spirit's second half. Hmm. Not to go find that, I suppose. There it is. I beg of you, lass. Keep me company. I wish to be reunited with my innocence. Alright, come along. I'll take you there.
It's almost like he's taking me there. Oh, no, never mind. He's, uh... There we go. Cool. We owe you our everlasting gratitude. May you receive his blessing. Stray not from your destined path. Serpent key. Nice. I suppose this is the key I'm missing. Stray not from my destined path, huh? A corridor? We're awaiting you beyond the crimson bridge. No choice but to go through here, I suppose. But do save. The progress apps of fucking loot. Do you think I'm doing all of that again? You got me fucked up. Oh. No, you don't. No, you don't. Oh, Rose Marine. Rose Marine. Rose Marine, wait. I'm back here. I'm losing my wits in this maze. I can't move. I'm paralyzed. He speaks not, but the truth. Fortune runs in your blood, lass. It's you again, you wretched serpent. I can feel its warmth. How deeply you ache for this wish of yours, lass. Can you feel it? This venom of mine reaching down to your fingertips. I'm burning. What are you doing to me, you wretch? This fear residing in you is merely a pebble in your path.
It's your coronation. You're conceiving one tribute at a time, and thus... You ought to keep faith in his word. As it is he who's to honor your name. And you who is to reunite with him at the peak of the full moon. Reunite? I've never met him. Embrace it, Elisa. Your most vile lust for sub. Your vi most vile lust for sub. Your, your mom. Your thirst for. Promis. For promiscuous blasphemy. Leb Kuhin, what are you saying? Pursue it, Elisa. I ache to drink from your venom and bask in your glory. My glory? Your most vile thirst for extravagance. Your devotion to opulence. I ache to dine on your flesh and bathe in your radiance. Let me go, you. Embossome it, Elisa. Your fearless lust for all that shines gold. Allow me, Elise, to endow you with all that is my being and my purpose. I ache to adore your name, your beauty. I yearn for the taste of your venom. Savor it, Elise. Revel in it, Elise. Indulge, Elise. By this deliverance of chastity and by your her heredity as I bear witness so be it Needle Testament. Uh. My whole body is aching. Rose and Marina, Lebekuhen, and Freya. They were all... It's this dream again, but I... When did I fall asleep? Are you deaf? You ought to hurry now, or you'll miss it. Miss what? Hurry now, hurry now. I need the full song. <laughs>
Oh. It's in my pocket. I think last night really happened. I'd best to go find Rosa and Marina. Captain Fireflies 12. I thought it would end at 10, but no. 12. This is different. What in the Lord's name? Good, good thing you're here, Elise. Ah, uh, I brought Flock in be because of the rain, you see. He's well behaved anyhow, aren't you, Froke? It's raining? Oh, you hadn't noticed? Alright, well, it doesn't matter. You went out last night. Actually, I think it's raining here as well. Because I'm seeing, um... Down where my computer, it says the weather. Uh, it says heavy rain, so... Let me check. I'm literally right in front of the window, but the curtains are shut, so... Let me see. Ah! Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, it's... I, I can't tell if it's raining, but it is windy. So... It does look like it is either gonna rain, or it's already raining, and I just can't see it. So, uh, yep, it's, uh, pretty normal UK weather. You went out last night. I did? I got the second testament, I suppose. Oh, Elisa, that's wonderful. You can prepare the gift now. I was starting to fret because you've been avoiding talking about it. There isn't much to talk about, Jose Marina. Ever since we went there together, you've become a little... ...said it yourself, didn't you? But I ought to do this myself, for my own sake, and... Well, I didn't mean, you know... You're right, Elise. It truly does only concern you. Going to the woodland with you on Tuesday wasn't... <laughs> you agree, don't you, Froke? <laughs> He's a goat, Rosa Marina. Anyhow, it's best we move along before it gets late. And so... The sweetest nectar, right? That's the poison. Wait a, wait a minute. I thought I removed this. I must have, um, I must have reset, like, after. Yeah, it really is raining, shit. Pretty normal UK weather, um... It's really pouring, isn't it? Oh, we'll be drenched in no time. It reminds me of when Granny and I would go on strolls in the rain. Why would you do such a thing? 
It's as Granny always used to say it, Isa. We ought to embrace things as they are, in their purest state. I'm not sure that applies to the rain, Rosa and Marina. Why? It applies to everything in life, Elisa. If you say so. This week went by so quickly, didn't it? No, it did not. No, I barely even noticed. Like, it, I, I noticed too hard, actually. I can hardly believe it's almost a full moon, too. What of it, Rosa and Marina? Your fate will be revealed tomorrow, Elisa. Both our fates, both our fates in a way. You truly can't think of anything else, can you? Can you? For goodness sake. I can tell you're rather restless, Elisa. Well, I haven't been having much rest lately, have I? I suppose, but... It's alright, Rosa Marine. We ought to embrace it, right? Embrace everything in, in its purest state. Yes. Say it, Isa. Why don't you go into your grandmother's room? There's nothing to see there, is all. I suppose, but... It's where she passed, too. I... I don't like to be rem reminded of it. I haven't gone back to my granny's resting place, either. So you do understand why I don't go in there. In a way, I do. In a way, huh? Granny Hall's room, huh? I won't be going in there ever again, I don't think. I think we will. Serpent isn't to be trusted, I know, but even so, I still want it. I still want him to grant my wish, to become rich, to escape this town and live the life I deserve. make much sense that like there's rain and it doesn't like doesn't like it doesn't hit the water but yeah I think they just didn't want to do this whole area I also just realized that... Where's everyone? I suppose folks wouldn't like standing in the rain. Folks don't care about that in, Kif in Kifferberg, Rosa Marina. Come now, let's see what's going on. I do that. I can't help but think it was ill will, Miss uh, Miss Marielle. What was Miss Ariane? Oh, it is a. It's awful. Freya's maple got torn down because of the wind and the rain. You think someone did all that to the maple, Miss Ariane? That's what we all think, Adisa. 
Are you certain it couldn't have been the rain? With all that's been going on, lass. It's such a shame. She put so much time into it. Maybe we're making a greater deal out of it than we than we ought to. I'm certain I'm certain that's it, Miss Marlin. Oh, how do I Oh, how I would like to believe you, Odisa. Even I will lend Freya a hand with the maypole if I if need be, Bertha. These two lassies will do too, I wager. Of course, Mr. Hainrich. This was ill will, father. It could have been the rain, Miss Bertha. As it likely was, anyhow. What matters is that we lend Freya a hand. Uh, a hand, folks. Hainrich is right. Uh, we can't be without a maple tomorrow. Oh, it truly has been one thing after another. We ought to gather for prayers. I would like all of Kieferberg to gather in church this afternoon. You're doing something at last. It's imperative we are all united and of the same mind. I'll make certain to spread the word, Father. Gathering all these frightened folks in the same place can't be a good thing. I suppose I can't miss it, though. A nice detail. Can you fuck off? Where are you? I don't see you. Did she just speak? What? Maybe I'll splurge a little this time. Hello, wooden boxes. Barrels and materials assembled into a festival stall. No, I ain't giving you shit. Konogaki. It was you, Adisa. What have I done now, Martha? You tore down the maypole. Have you completely lost your mind, Melly? Ah, uh, so it wasn't you, Adisa. Of course it wasn't me, you little... Shit. Wait. Have you been telling folks it was me? Who? <laughs> not yet. I came to you for some apple strudel. You're not telling anyone anything of the sort, you hear me? <laughs> Watch me. I can run really fast, Elise. I don't even know where to get apple strudel. <laughs> Spread all the nonsense you want, Matilda. It's not like folks take you seriously, anyhow. <laughs> oh, you'll regret this, Elise. You dare drag my name name through the mud and I'll throw you. Oh, that increased by three. Who cares at this point? Please don't let anyone be in here. Please don't let anyone be here. Please don't let anyone be here. Please don't let anyone be here. Yes. Ghost is clear. I want to see if... Maybe I missed something in here. Hold on. Oh my fucking god. I did it the other way around. Are you shitting me? They're all lit now, but... There's still something missing, I think. 
There's something in there, but I can't reach it. It's glowing really bright, too. Um... No, not that. Um... How do I get it? Is there any way I can I can use a broom? Surely I can reach with that, no? Yeah, I don't think I can I can get that just yet. Best I can do. do I have seven <laughs> literally just seven um I'm afraid <coughs> I'm afraid Wilma simply won't listen Ariane Miss Wilma is being unreasonable unreasonable again I'd wager Wilma is refusing to allow folks to work in her in even though we can't make ourselves useful in this rain Miss Wilma has always been like this hasn't she Next thing we know, she'll be blaming Miss Wilma for it. I wouldn't say you're wrong, Elisa. She's right. Wilma's always been difficult. I wouldn't put it past her to blame poor Wilma. Oh, to think we were so hopeful just this Sunday. A festival's tomorrow, Miss Ariane. It'll be our, it'll be fine. We can only hope, Elisa. Spishing down. <laughs> Fuck that bitch. What have you been doing at it? What are you doing out here in the rain, Lev Kuham? I've been visiting folks' homes, is all. What for? Everyone's a little bit on edge because of the rain. Father Hans wanted me to help settle the townsfolks. Saying you to entertain this foolery, huh? That's alright, Lisa. I'm feeling rather well rested. Even if that's the case, Lev Kuham. It's the festival tomorrow, Lisa. What does the festival have to do with it? Why, it's only one more day. As long as you don't push it. I won't, I won't. Alright, um... Don't catch a cold standing out here, Rosa Marina. That's alright, Lisa. I'm used to it. And it's so awfully nostalgic, too. Nostalgic, you say? I miss spending time in nature, you see? Granny and I would often dance about in the rain. You'd be catching colds quite often, I imagine. Oh, on the contrary. I may look fragile, but I'm tough. Stubborn, too. Elisa! I wouldn't know what to do if you got sick, Rosa Marina. I can take care of myself, Elisa. Oh, don't you start. I'm trying to look after you here. Like you always do, I know. Oh, for goodness sake. I... Ill will is inevitable, as much as it saddens me to say. Folks uh, are at their wits' end, that's what. I wouldn't say it's ill will. I understand, Lass. Nobody wants to believe one of us could have done it. That's because it wasn't one of us. You're the one who's at the root of all this. Uh, you're the one who's at the root of all this. Here, say nonsense, old... Here, say nonsense, old Yochen. Come now, Bernard, let's keep it civil. Mr. Bernard's right, I'd say. Folks wouldn't have thought of the witch if it hadn't been for old Yochen. 
In fact, I'd wager folks would have forgotten about it by now if you let them. I must say I agree, lass. Many things could have been avoided. No, many things have been avoided thanks to me. Be as it may, we're to take this week as a learning experience. Which is why we ought to gather for a Virgil. Gather everyone for a prayer that will bring us together. I've let Leb Kuhan know to make preparations. Suspicions down. Haha, <laughs> fuck you, you old fuck. Oh my god, shut up! I can't- oh my god, I can't do this shit. Okay, well that's a relief, Linda. What is Miss Lisbeth? Oh, we were chatting about the festival, Lisa. It's finally happening, but now we have this rain. We've had it. We've had worse in the little lane, Miss Elizabeth. That's true. Things are looking up despite everything. And Apfel seems to be feeling better. I figured I would let them both out for a little while. Has he stopped talking about the witch, Elizabeth? I don't know, Linda. I think he's keeping something from me. My two remaining goats are still ill too, Miss Elizabeth. The festival will bring back some peace, Lisbeth. Father Hans has finally arranged for a doctor to drop by at least. Oh, that's wonderful, Lisbeth. Wait, actually, I already... Uh, that's fine. I'm here. Might as well while I'm at it. Kiss the rat, kiss the rat. Oh, for goodness sake. Kiss the rat, kiss the rat. Kiss the rat, kiss the rat. For fuck's sake, fine. You two have problems, you know that? We'll make you kiss it, Elisa, whether you like it or not. Uh, yes. Choo. Um, oh, there we go. I'm gonna try to get an S, but I don't think it's possible anymore. And not after that one, no. accept that. I do not and will not accept that. Sucks.
That was better than usual. I'll take it. You know what? Um, we almost had it, Jacob. Here you go, Adisa. I suppose I could have gone a little easier on you two. Hmm. No, I, I think I need 60, though. I think doing the wood one is probably better because... It, um... Because having Rosen and Marina there is, uh, is actually beneficial. Ah, it is there. I can lend you a hand with the maple, Freya. Oh, it's not that. It's Miss Wilma. She won't allow me and Miss Linda to work on the maple inside the inn. Oh, for goodness sake. Because of the rain, you see. Why does she always have to be such a bitch? I'll finish that for her. It's alright, Elisa. Miss Linda will be stopping by to lend a hand uh, in a little while. These folks are pushing it. That's what. I figured out, Elisa. If you say so. I can't see shit. Oh my, where the fuck are... I should have just opened the map instead of walking around aimlessly. What fuck is it? It's oh my god, it's at the fucking entrance. Ah. Uh. It's annoying. Might as well talk to them. There must have been someone. That's for certain. About the maple, I assume? Odelia is certain it was ill will, Elisa. You've seen what the windstorm did to Kieferberg last Sunday, Odelia. Perhaps the maple suffered the same fate. We all had enough, Miss Odelia. The festival's tomorrow, Miss Odelia. Give it a rest. On the contrary, lass. I've, it's never been this bad. Now that's... A proper exaggeration, Odelia. She's right, Matilda. Didn't Father Hans say we're to gather this afternoon? If there's anyone who will know what to do, it'll be him. Oh, you lot will never understand. Nice. How much do I have now? Two. I wish that was a faster way to move around, because... This, this is tedious as fuck. Like, I would have really appreciated the fast travel about now. The old geezer is unbelievable. What's the matter now, Miss Wilma? Old Wilhelm promised me to meet me here, yet he's nowhere to be found. How's Wilma to fix the inn without his tools? Miss Wilma? Why, she does nothing all day. Last might as well ha might as well have her lend a hand. I thought she was looking after your inn, Miss Wilma. Looking after my inn, you say? All she does is sit at the counter all day. Keeping your shop open, Miss Wilma. Why, that's the least she can do, wouldn't you say? I suppose, but I wouldn't. 
She's right where she belonged, that's what. Leaving for Primaldorf at the first chance she got. To learn a trade, she said. All I've seen her learn is to sleep on the job. Yeah, she's everyone's favorite. Prettier, nicer, with big, uh, with bigger hair and bigger... Ah, I see how it is. I mean, she is hotter, I must admit. Always got the praise while I've been here working myself to the bone. Oh my god, please shut up. Alright, where's the... There you are. Oh my god. Oh, Elise. I'm so glad to see you. What can I help you with, Mr. Hotel? I'm going to be landing Freya a hand in a little while, you see. Could you fetch me some logs for the hearth in the meantime? Of course. Leave it to me. I'll bring you as many as you need. Oh, thank you, Elisa. And yes, I do want those in Marina. Oh, some peace and quiet. Again? No, nope. no, I'm good. I'm good for life. Oh, I knew I could count on you, Elisa. There you go. For your time. Damn. Thank you, Mr. Otea. I can spend longer helping Freya now. How wonderful. Okay. Get something for that goddamn sanity because I do not know how to. I do not know how I'm gonna deal with this shit. Honestly, I'd rather see the hung the hunger screen than the than the fear screen. Like that one's like annoying as shit. Is it just me, or does... Does sanity just drop way too fast? Like... Like, I wasn't in- I wasn't in there for that long, but I feel like it just... 
No, those are key items. Can I sell the porcelain knife? I mean, I can try. It's one, it's one buck. Sure, don't know what I'm gonna use it for anyway. You have such lovely features, don't you know that? Oh, thank you. Never be as beautiful as you. Um, eat a piece of bread. <laughs> Let me save, just in case, like, I really can't get, um, like, I really can't get that, uh, that item yet, which I should be able to, right? Wait, it ain't there anymore. So it has to be. So how the fuck do I get that? They're all lit now, but there's still something missing, I think. I wonder if there's something I could place here. I think there's something in here, but I can't reach it. It's going really bright, too. Surely there is... Something I can do. Like, anything. I if there's something I could place here. There is, but... Wait, that actually worked? I was- I was literally just pulling shit out of my ass. My brooch, it worked? Speaking of which, that ribbon the other day was rather similar to mine too. First my ribbon, now my brooch. I don't like this. Not one bit. Retrieve item? Yes. Acquired old tunnel key. Oh, <gasps> that's for the the other windmill. Another key. Wonder what this one is for. I know exactly what it's for. This key. I could try every lock and key from Bergen, still not find out what it is for. Maybe it's best I give it some thought. No need. I know exactly what it's for. Let's go. <laughs> so your progress, yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> there better not be anyone there. Uh, also, what I was in mind is at the creek, right? Remember that. Bang the letter W on its tip. Use. Yes. Barry entry three. A letter? It's torn, but I can't be convinced it was Valperga, the witch, who granted old holes, old old hole her sinful wish. No part of my research has corrob has corroborated her confession. None of it mentions him. I'm certain he, whoever he could be, is the key to Old Hole's last words. Unfortunately, I must confess to my own sinful ways, uh, ways through this letter, as my only chance at salvation after what I am about, what I am about to bring upon all of Kieferberg. There is no other way but to call upon Walpurga the Witch myself. Once I meet this witch, I will be able to determine one of two things. If she truly is our patroness, St. Walpurga, in her reformed glory, uh, as distracted, as distract, as, as dictated by the Lord, I can fully dedicate the rest of my life as a clergyman to her adoration and celebration of her miracles. If, however, she is not only a witch, but a demonic entity masquerading as one, I have no choice but to bring the Lord's justice upon hers and Elisa's wretched souls and end her reign once and for all. No. No, this can't be. This can't be true. I ought to... I have to find out more. I have to break into a study. This is where it's caved in, right? No, it isn't. Hold on. Oh! The catacombs key. Yet another key. There's a tag on it, though it's rather faded. Study. I think it, that's what it says. This is all I have now, I suppose. Father, Father Hans is study. I have to find a way out. Uh, find a way to sneak in. Ah, oh, shit. I'm dead. Um, that's fine. <laughs> okay, do I have the... Yes, I do. So I have the old tunnel key. Because I think sanity still goes down even during dialogue boxes, so it... Um... So it drops even when it shouldn't. It's so like when I'm stuck reading. But once I read it for the first time, I don't need to read it again, so...
Come on, grab it! You fucking idiot. You can do it. Please get out of here. Please get out of here before anything bad happens. Please, you can do it. Elisa, I believe in you. I shouldn't have believed. Can I make it out? Um, I don't think I can. Let me, hold on, let me actually load before this, because I think I, I just need to, because I think I've wasted just a little bit of time, and I think that little bit of time is um I think that little bit of time is is uh mandatory if I don't want to What happens if I leave without it? Curious. Uh, what's my sanity at? I think that's good. I think that's more than I had before. So I think... I think hopefully that's enough. To just... Barely get me out of there. I feel like the romantic date should probably like boost your like your um your sanity a little bit because like what the hell
All right, get out of here, Lisa. Go. I think I have more than enough. I think I'm good. I think I'm good to leave. Yes! Oh, and it didn't even trigger the... The annoying, like, whispers. Oh, I love that. That's what I call being a fish. Um... Unless... No, 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 Restart. Restart, 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 restart. Um... <laughs> Alright, can't forget my date with, uh, with Rosa Marina at the creek, wherever that is. Where the fuck is the creek? Um... Oh. I just passed by it. Great. Uh, which, by the way, I did get, uh... This is the safe bow after I got the... Got the keys and all. Yes. Yes. Lab iron skeleton key. Right here. Where is she? Uh, I don't see her anywhere. Where did she go? This is. Not where I'm supposed to go, but actually, let me let me try this. Never mind. All right. Not the creek. Where is she? Is there somewhere that I don't know about the creek? 
Not like a like a hidden place. You better not be hiding, I swear to god. here actually I'm an idiot I should have gone and s to see like oh yeah, it's the same Um, is the game bugged? Is that why she doesn't appear? Is it because there's also the... Am I supposed to do the other thing first? But won't the... Tent the village, council, and church. I guess that's not gonna skip time. I'll try. Brethren, I've guided you I've guided you here today to address the recent goings on. You're rather late, father. We've had enough. Show some respect, Alma. No, she's right. We need answers, father. I'm afraid we will not be getting many today, Guido. Is this yet another plea for us to overlook the situation? Why don't we let Father Hans take the lead? He's had it all week, and look where it got us, Gustav. We're here to gather... We're, uh, we're to gather here this evening for a Virgil, brethren. Together, we are to appeal to the Lord's mercy and benevolence as well as... All that'll do is put a lid on folks' troubles, father. That's right, we need this witch to pay. Who would you suggest ought to pay, Lorelei? Where is this witch you folks speak of? Gustav's right. We don't know where to turn. Prayer will show us the path we ought to follow, brethren. Why? I've prayed all day. Every night and nothing's changed, father. I fear my poor Jacob, father. Whoever is out there, they're taking our children, compromising our livelihoods. It's a decision folks want, Hans. We ought to search every lass in town for the witch's mark. We ought to do no such thing, you old geezer. That's no way to address your elders, Elisa. Perhaps if my elders hadn't completely lost their wits. Rest assured, Elisa, no lasting Keeperberg will be searched, young or old. You fools still resist. Still resist what must be done. Old Yochan is right. You must see this through. Are you going to do it then, Mr. Ludwig? If there's anyone who ought to do it, it's Leb Ku... It's Leb Ku him. Me, Miss Brunhilde? Of course, lass. You're a woman of God. Woman of God or not, Leb Ku is to be searched as well. None of you are touching her. Still, Elisa, we ought to search someone. It may be for the best, Elisa. 
Are you searching Freya too then? And Miss Lisbeth? No exceptions, lass. Truth is, we don't know anything about your cousin, Elisa. Why don't we start with her? That's right. It all started the day she got here. No, I haven't done anything. Nobody's laying a finger on her. I saw her. I saw Elisa's cousin. She's the witch. My beloved daughter. Elisa saw her too. She talked to the witch. There it is, folks. They're the witches. Oh, Apfel. So it was true, Elisa. You and your cousin, uh, you and your cousin are the one, ones who have been making our lives hell. No, you're mistaken. We've done nothing of the sort. Confess, a lot of you. Confess your sins, you wretched, you wretched witches. Did you or did you not meet your cousin in the woods, Elisa? Of course I didn't. I was all by myself right until I found him. Why? The lad says he saw you two, Elisa. I didn't meet anyone in the woods, I swear. Oh my goodness, look. It's the witch. The witch is here. Oh, we're all going to die. We must keep calm, folks. Keep calm. She was there. I saw her. She had yellow eyes. What do you have to say for yourself, lass? I was nowhere near the woods. I'd gone home by then. How are we to know such a thing, you witch? If the lad says he saw you, lass... N no, I... I truly had gone home. Why are you doing you su this, you little... Is she even your cousin, Elisa? Truly, I've been thinking about it all week. I am. I truly am her cousin. I... Not even you know your own cousin, Elisa. Perhaps she's been a bad influence on you. She's anything but. You folks are losing your mind. Bad influence or not, what matters is whether she's a witch. How do you explain your... Cousin's cookie getting up. Wait, how do you explain your cousin's cookie get up, Elisa? All the things she said and done, too. I, I've never. She's just a lassie. Pinning it on my cousin isn't going to solve. Alphil says. Said he saw you two in the woods, Elisa. He's just a boy. We must be reasonable here. I've heard enough. Search her. We ought to search the last right now. Find the witch's mark. I will take no more of this nonsense. This is enough. Can't you see what you're doing to Kieferberg? Can't you see this witch nonsense turning us against each other? The witch is clearly right here in Kieferberg, lass. Nobody in Kieferberg could ever do such a thing, old Yochen. We're a family, all of Kieferberg, no exceptions. Although we all understand your feelings, Freya. 
You clearly don't, father. Nobody does. Apfel believes he's seen the witch. Folks have, folks have been on edge all, all day. All of this is a consequence of how we've been facing this crisis. With fear, hostility, and hesitation. That's all very nice, Freya. But we need to do something. Let's do the Virgil then. Work on the preparations for the festival together. Like the family we are. The family we've always been. Freya. Would you folks truly burn me at the stake? Or Elise, Lev Kuhan, or even Rose Marin? Rose Marina? I expected more from my family. That's all I wanted to say. You said more than enough, Freya. All of Kieferberg is to meet here tonight for prayer. As we ought uh, as we ought to have done from the start. Hmm. Move along now, folks. We're to focus on what we ought to do. Protect our home at all costs. Pray your best, girl. All eyes on me. Divert the village's suspicion away from you. I didn't like that one bit. Best I head back to work. Alright, let's see. I should be able to use that key I found, but it doesn't seem like I can. It's not for this door, and it's got to be for something in here. Father Hans study. I wonder when I'll be able to sneak in. Ah, do you have a moment, Elisa? Of course, Miss Ariane. I must tell you, I'm ashamed about earlier. I couldn't bring myself to speak up for you. Miss Ariane. You're coming to the Virgil, aren't you? Of course. That's good, Elisa. That will help show them that you're committed. We can't allow any more of this nonsense. Okay, can you not move me? Thank you. Rude. Remember sneaking to fire the... Uh... No, they don't have junk on them. Doesn't seem like this is what I should be using here. Fragrant mountain breeze, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so hold on. Where the hell do I use it? Here, maybe? No wonder Father Hans is a miserable wretch. If I try something else, what if it's behind here? Nebkuhem, I know it, Isa. That was. I can't explain. I. Folks are completely out of their minds, Nebkuhem. I was there, Lisa. It's all right. They weren't being reasonable. I wonder what's going into Appel. More importantly, Elisa. Now that we're alone together, I'd like to ask you. I didn't meet anyone in those woods, Lepkuhin. Alright, I... I just need to hear it directly from you is all. I wouldn't lie to you, you know that. Uh, you kind of are. I do, yes. It's probably right behind here.
May put it like that, Tristan. Don't let the whole ordeal get to you, lass. What do you mean, Mr. Tristan? Folks lost their mind for a while, is all. All of Kipperberg's on edge. They don't mean what they say. Ah, uh, I suppose you're right. I want to come by later for the Virgil, Elisa. Both you and your cousin, you hear? Of course, Mr. Gustav. I won't miss it. Still, had it not been for Freya... You want to be proud, Gustav? He's my pride and joy. My pride and joy. Wait. Wait, there's one here too? Since when? Polish completely smooth. The pretty stone basin sits untouched. What do you mean sits untouched? There you are. Oh, she looks so sad. There she is. I'll spend time with her. Ah, Elise, look what I found. A rock. Oh, but doesn't it look like Froke? There's even a little tail, look. A little tail, you say? I see it. This one too, doesn't it look like a chicken? There's the beak, see? So this is how you put that bracelet together, huh? Uh, yes, that's right. Lord knows why you're so drawn to useless junk. It stops being junk the moment you give it meaning, Elisa. That bracelet means plenty to both of us, wouldn't you say? Oh, shush. Say, Rosa Marinette, how come I can't seem to find meaning in any of this? What do you mean, Elisa? Kieferberg's so dear to everyone, yet I'm treated like a wretch. Working myself to the bone, putting up with their ill tempers. It all made sense when Granny Hall was still with me. I think your Granny's passing has affected us in similar ways. Not right now, Rosa Marina. We're nothing alike, Rosa Marina. Oh. All Granny Hall's passing meant for me was isolation. That too, Elise. I felt lonesome as well, but you see... That's when I started following my own path, and I'd say... You'd say the, the same applies to me, huh? Doesn't it? Not in Kieferberg. Ros Rosa Marina, there's nothing for me here. I'm much more than what this town sees in me. Ah, uh, look, Elisa. There's something in the creek. Huh? It's gold. You see, Elisa, I don't think meaning is something you find. I think it's something you create. Take that nugget we just found, for example. What about it? Something so precious sitting in such a place, waiting to be seen. It reminds me of you, Adisa. 
I'm not asking you to change your mind about Kiefenberg, but chasing after what truly matters to you, that's where meaning is found. Meaning, huh? It's not the same for everyone, is it? You ought to focus on what truly matters most to you, Adisa. That's... There's something I'd like to tell you, Elisa, and I'd say that there's something you'd like to tell me, too. I suppose there might be, but... Come now, let's head back to town before you get any redder. Hurry, Elisa. Why, you... That should be all of them, right? That's all of the hearts, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> no, that's just hell. Oh shit, wait, I don't have food. Oh, um, I guess the only thing you can do is the soup. How much will the berries cost? Or sell for. <laughs> I'm selling four each. So, actually, yeah, that's that's not bad. I'll take it. Anything else? Some pretzels, maybe. I'm buying your very famous. Oh wait, apple strudel. Hold up. How was I gonna get this before? Maybe it's gifted to you, I don't know. I'm gonna get your famous lip poo ham. Alright, see you, Granny. Eat. Nom nom nom. So, the chickens and the rats, okay. I think I'm gonna do the chickens. Oh, this is also overflowing. The Kuhin and I used to play about in the water all the time, didn't we? Though we were a little too old- Though we're a little too old for that now, I suppose. Forever more decorated with blooming flowers. Though it was before. <laughs> Wait. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, Kieferberg's crest rests atop the square fountain in its ancient glory.
I won't bite you, Miss Odelia. Oh, Adiza, what am I to do? I've been scared witless all week. Everyone can tell, Miss Odelia. Oh, will you please fetch me some eggs, lass? Sure. That's what you need, Miss Odelia. Yes. Out of my way, you feathered rat. I'm gonna use my keyboard, though, instead of my controller. Chicken frenzy. Round one, three, two, one, go. Fucking bitch. I, I turned, you fucking cunt. Oh my god, I hate this. Oh my god. Nine rank B? Yeah, no. Absolutely not, no. Yeah, no, no, I'm trying that one again. You you got me fu no 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 get fucking no 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 I want to try that one again, you fucking cunt. You fucking little shit go Oh yeah cunt Oh my god Pass? I don't- I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna accept the pass. No. Not to be sad, it's a miss, Odelia. And I didn't save, did I? Uh, I guess I'm just gonna have to deal with this. Alright, you know what I'm go what the- Epilepsy warning. Hold on, let me, um... Let me get the... Oh, hi. Good day, yeah. On your way home, lass? Wouldn't it be best if we walked you home, Elisa? Ah, uh, that's... It's no trouble, lass. There's no need to pray, Mr. Gustav. I'll be alright. If you say so, Elisa. The sooner you go, the better. I'll see you in church then. I'll be there, Freya. Best get to the to preparing supper too, Freya. Let's have a word with Father Hans before this Virgil. Oh my God, that is just. So, uh, epilepsy warning. <laughs> there are flashing lights. <laughs> Can I please leave? Oh my god. Let me grab a lip to him. Oh my god. Yeah, can you... Yeah. God. You're going to fall... You're going to fall ill again at this rate, lab. I can look after myself, Adisa. 
It's best you get some rest before this Virgil, don't you think? Don't you think it's rather odd, Elisa? What is that, Kuhan? I have a strange feeling about tonight's Virgil. It all feels a little... As though there's a false sense of calm. Folks did change their tunes rather quickly, that's true. Here, before I forget... Actually... Do you think they might all lose, lose their minds again t tonight? Not necessarily, but... I must admit, I'm feeling nervous about the festival too. You spent too much time comforting folks today, Lev. You're rather calm too, Elisa. I've been tormented over this witch nonsense all week. I suppose I can't blame you there. It's best I move along now. I still need to have supper. I'll see you in church. Only if you promise to get some sup some proper rest before the Virgil. Hold on, actually. Can there... Can you please not flash me like that? That is very rude. Um, can I go into the church? I can. Please don't have anyone in here. Alright, let's see. Where can I sneak in? Father Hunt's Holy Scripture rests upon blah blah blah. Basking in its holy glory, the image of St. Walpurgis solemnly watches over Kipperberg Church. Doesn't seem to be working. How do I get in here? Hmm. Maybe it's upstairs? Oh god. I mean, it's a nice touch that they... That they left it here too, but... God. <laughs> Maybe I can't do it yet? Like, it has to be something for... For another time, because I also couldn't use the. Um, I think that's what it might be, because I also couldn't use the fish key in the fountain. As much as I dislike Sunday mass, I have to admit I feel at peace here. Too bad the old geezer is always about. Bathed in sunshine, uh, sunshine at night. Each stained glass panel casts a warm glow over the church's gelid marble. Is there like a visual cue? On, let me see. If not for this door, then it's got to be something in there. Okay. So... I need to find something else to open that. Alright. Got it.
Oh my god. What are you doing out here? Are you, are you trying to... Why do you come dance with us, Elise? We have to get ready for the Virgil or those in Marina. We're having such lovely weather. Lovely weather, you say? Froke agrees, don't you, Froke? Goodness sake. I'm heading inside. Come along, it doesn't mighty now. Uh, it is a wait. Poor Frocker. So, we're going to this Virgil? We are to Rosamari now. Folks need to see we're committed. Say it, Elisa. I know you don't like to talk about it, but... You're meeting him tomorrow, aren't you? I suppose. You still don't have the sweetest nectar, do you? You went to the woodland last night. What about it? You've been gathering the testaments, and... All I have is that needle, Rosa Marina. A needle? That's the testament I received last night. They... I mean, I... Pricked my finger on it, too. The sweetest nectar also needs a part of your mortal body, remember? So you mean the flesh, the blood, and the heart, Elise. Those are the... We can talk about it after the Virgil, alright? You get changed now. I've brought some bread. Ah, uh, alright. Come, we should hurry or we'll be or we'll be drenched. Say Rose Marina. About the sweetest nectar. It's your determination that matters most, remember? What does that mean, Rose Marina? Blood. That's what you're going to offer him, isn't it? Well you must show him your commitment, Lisa. Whatever you do, you must prove you're willing to leave everything behind. Your faith, your loved ones. Rosa Marina. You have to want it, Elisa, don't... You have to want it, Elisa, do you? Leaving anything behind, huh? As much as I do want it, I must admit, I'm a little hesitant. Alright. Then the Virgil, yes. Oh, God. 
Can I? Where are you? Is that serpent? I have no choice but to carry on, do I? Show yourself. I know you're in here somewhere, Serpent. Oh, what am I doing? Getting myself into this mess, and for what? To get out of Kieferberg? To leave it all behind? But at what cost? The tender flesh. The sweetest nectar. All these things I've seen and done, I'm beginning to wonder. If I really meet him, if he can, if he can grant this wish of mine. This wish of yours is within your grasp. Can I truly attain it? You've received his blessing, have you not? Trust yourself, Ediza. Trust his word. I could get out. Leave this town behind. And I've... All I've ever been here... All I've ever been here is a maid of all work. A stray. Ever since Granny Hole passed, I've been nothing but an outsider. Now you're a witch, Elisa. A witch. Unshackle your burning desire from the depths of your very begin of your very being. Embrace it, Elisa. Your rightful fortune and wealth, your freedom. I want it. I want my second chance at happiness. Huh? What in the... It's the town square. I must be dreaming. This can't be real. What is that? There is... There's something in the church. I mean, that serpent's depths, no doubt. A delicately decorated fountain stands tall in the village square. 
its stone surface adorned with eerie motifs. Miss Linda's house, torn in half by thorns and branches, the home's roof floats above its foundations. I don't know why I tried that. No. Oh, wait. <gasps> I was not- I forgot about these- <laughs> about her. About them. You've come here to stay, I see. Says who? A place of solace. That's where our beloved Azrael is providing for us here. All of... All I've heard in here was weeping, though. We are all doomed. All of us. We've lost everything. All we have left... Are you- are these deaths? What's so great about this place, would you say? The silence. He never visits here. I can't say I understand. No, I understand fully. Oh, and now I have to deal with... I have to deal with my lack of sanity. Is that? That sounds like Rose Marine. It's that serpent. I must find a way into that church. This wasn't here before. I guess it was. Oh my god, this is annoying. It's like a bubble of sorts. Everything seems to be underwater, but I, c I can breathe just fine. Maybe best have a look about town. Oh. It's completely destroyed. I have to find my way out of this place. These moon phases, I wonder what they're for. They seem to be connected somehow. These trees are everywhere, huh? Hang from its blue tinted branches, the many glistening berries sway gently in the water. Berries. Ow. Ow. No, you fucking bitch.
You fucking bitch! Okay, hold on. This is... What moon is this? Huh? Wait, this is only a crescent moon. Wait, this is wrong? Because that's not on there. That's not on the... Alright, let's try... No? I don't think that was correct. Can get past these. I have to do something. I think if if I didn't sell that that porcelain knife, I probably would have been able to skip this puzzle, or I might have been able to skip this puzzle, maybe. Who knows? I don't think I, I got it. Oh, this puzzle is so fucking difficult. Fuck. Can you not do that, you fucking bitch? Wait, what? Where is it? Okay. Don't you dare! I swear I've tried every order. Unless I didn't try this, this, and this. Wait a minute. No, I've tried every order. But like, what? Wait, this is the... Something isn't right. Something is very wrong. They truly didn't number on Kimperberg, huh? If only they could see this. We're thinking about the woodland Kimperberg's various homes are now at its mercy. You can literally just jump, you dumbass. But what hit me? What? What the fuck? What touched me? Yeah, I didn't forget about this, thankfully. Thought I would. Wait a minute. I just noticed she had the red shoes. Thank <laughs> you. 
completely destroyed to find my way out of this place. Not a goddamn second. Only, only one can be pressed at a time. Wait, I never noticed it. Oh, there it was. Hold well on. No. Don't know how I avoided that, but I am not complaining. Um. Oh my god, wait, hold on. No, you don't. Wait, they're... They're now remained pressed. Or not. Wait, hold on. So if I do this, you even notice there was one there. No. Then this one. Then this is Half Moon, right? I want to assume that did something, but I do not think it did. So what if I do it like... Maybe it needs to go from... From this... To this... Wait a goddamn second. Do this. I don't think that was correct. Um. I don't get it. I'm looking at the thing, but I don't. I don't get it. That's a crescent moon, so I don't think that's correct. Or am I supposed to press all of them? No, that can't be right. I do not think that's correct. How does this work? Does it go from... This...
to this. To this? No. I'm so tired of these giggling and whispering, like it's so annoying. What a... Correct. Um, I do not know. I'm going to take a break. <laughs> this one actually is hurting my brain, and these whispers do not help. Um, and my hair is stuck. Okay, great. Wait. You guys are still laughing at me. Like, what the fuck? How 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 have you not lost your voice by now? Um, and also I still have no idea how this works. These moon phases, I wonder what they're for. They seem to be connected somehow. What do you think? Hmm? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No. 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 I. I refuse. I absolutely refuse. What the fuck? What hit me? So up here, the moon, like it's a half moon up here, which, and it's the, it's the half that it shows on here, and I didn't notice because there's two half moons for some fucking reason. Ah. 
When did I last save? I don't even know. Just die. Why is the heart still beating? Why is this still beating? Why is it? Ah, uh, it's still beating. What? The heartbeat completely replaced any sort of audio. Or is that just my headphones? No, no, that's that's how it's going in the in the what? Why? It's still it's still beating. Uh, well, it, it's fixed. I think. I assume. <laughs> I think it's fixed. <laughs> More bears, nice. I'm turning into Moon May now. We're moving now. Berries. Wee. <laughs> That's how it works. This does nothing. This one I'm just At this point I'm just going like random bullshit girl. Oh my fucking god. I figured it out somehow. I don't know how, but I did. I have to get a grip and go find her. Oh my god. That puzzle sucked. I hated that one. Take heed, lass. We don't take kindly to light in these depths. For goodness sake, that startled me. They don't take kindly to light, do they? The inanimate head rests peacefully, nested in the berry, berry bush foliage. Absolutely, I'm overriding that. That one sucks. That one was awful. I 
I would have fallen down these stairs a hundred percent. Can you imagine like falling down like the paradox stairs? Like the Lupin ones? Oh. I, I need to turn the light off, I think. I think that's what it wants me to do. Oh, I can't see shit. Ah. Okay, please see something. I can't see shit. How the fuck do I? I can't uh, I got berries. Now turn to mermaid. All the guys I'm picking up. The fuck? Yep, there it is. I should, do, I should do some testing and see like if it will allow me to to see or maybe I just need to run ah well it you know it kind of worked like but I think I think I can run from it No, it's too fast. I'm <laughs> 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 
I saw a path through there. I saw a different road. Uh, you know, I'm I'm not a game dev, so I don't think this is supposed to show up. I don't think there's supposed to be this here, but all right, cool game. You do you. Wait a minute. I mean, at least there's not a line there anymore. Wait, what if I... I see the trick. You're supposed to turn it on and off. It's hard to, like, look at your surroundings. Oh, my God. 
This is like a weeping angels kind of thing where like where instead of no I can't tell what it, where I'm supposed to go, but I'm supposed to be. I close the other face. There. <laughs> kind of quiet is the game a bit loud um both oh wait no the game is loud what the fuck i don't know why but the death of audio was like was maxed out for some reason. In fact, there we go. That should be back to normal, back to how it used to be. Oh my god, please. Wait, no, I'm back at the beginning. Shit. Well. That's embarrassing. Um. What? I, I. Uh huh. Just came at me, didn't let me like look even for a split second. Okay, so now I know I went the wrong way. Um, Uh, where even are you? <laughs> Good question. Uh, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Okay, uh, lesson learned. You cannot move while, uh, while you have the light on. Berries. Yeah, 
I really don't like this room. Wait, I think I might have... Oh! Oh! Oh, thank you! Oh, thank fuck! Acquired Liar of Azrael. A liar? May your innermost desire come true, Elisa. This statue, it's speaking to me. No, it is you. Why don't... Why? Don't look so surprised. Weren't you talking to your own reflection a moment ago? Oh, I'll never get used to this nonsense. It all depends on you, Elisa. On how far you're willing to go. The sacrifices you're willing to make. I've come this far, haven't I? This isn't the last of your perils. You must find your resolve deep within yourself, Hadisa. I suppose I've been rather hesitant until now. If you don't fight for yourself, Hadisa, who will? I can only depend on myself, huh? Then so be it. A statue of me. These these fiends keep mocking me at every turn, huh? Statue of Elisa beholds the observer with a blank cold stare. What the fuck? I see the exit. If I miss something in that room specifically, I'm going to be pissed. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. Save. Save, absolutely. Go. Just... No looking back, just save. The village, yep. There's what I'm confused. So basically, uh, this is where we went into the forest, into not the crows, but the snakes, uh, lair, uh, and now we're basically seeing a vision of the village completely destroyed. And now Rose Marinez, or uh, a copy of Rose Marinez, you know, crucified. What in the. Or it could just be whatever that is. You're rather brave, lass. You. Ah, thank you. Yep. You're welcome. Do you yearn for wealth and fortune that deeply? I clearly do, Serpent. Now let her go. No, no, I don't think I will. What in the Lord's name? You know, there's something you have yet... There's something you have yet to come to terms with. Something you've been avoiding. What are you talking about? The good company, lass. You've sacrificed your mortal body for the tender flesh. You know it's blood you need for the sweetest nectar. Yet, it's the good company you refuse to surrender. What are you talking about? Show me the depths of your heart. What? I wish to see how dearly you care for your beloved. Oh, never mind. I was supposed to leave. Or 
not. Oh, wait, what? That was different. It's a good thing I saved. Oh my god, and I can't skip this? Am I supposed to use something for this? The brooch? Uh, the broom? Matches? I don't know. But I do need to heal. Ow. What the fuck? What hit me? Okay, so that's... Alright. You want to know how deeply I care for Rose and Marina? I've only known her for a week, but... That bracelet and that pine cone, she's... What? I can't find him without her. Rather keen to use the lass, aren't you? You're not worth my time, let alone his. Okay. I think I picked the wrong answer. Just a feeling. Just a thought. He saved before venturing in. I did, but also, like, now you tell me this? Okay, so I just need to dodge the attacks, which is really hard to do when you have no idea where they're coming from. And you have, like, a split second to realize where they're coming from. Can't I skip? <laughs> what is that? What? I haven't seen this. What? I I was ah. None of them could hit me. I know for a fact none of them were able to hit me. I've never seen that one before. That's annoying. Oh god, wait, it starts with this attack? Oh god. Nope, this again. Ah!
I've had a couple of them. I don't know, one up a week back. Listen to that phone. And that stone. Those mean more to me than I could ever than I ever thought they could. I oh my god oh and my controls are reversed. I I can't my controls are reversed. No, I can't. I. Okay, thank you. I would very much appreciate it. You... It's fine. It's fine. Just, just eat the berries. Be like Mume and eat the berries. Or Mume collects berries more like. She never really eats them. I can't say I fully understand. I can't say I fully understand her most of the time. Everything about her is so strange, so foreign to me. All of her nonsense about fate, it... scares me, doesn't make sense. I can't make sense of it. I don't share her fate. Do you truly think it's a matter of fate, Lassie? You're not worth my time, let alone his. Shit. I'm I'm surprised I surprised I dodged either of them. That yeah. That makes sense. Um I thought it was the fire one. Oh uh, okay. I don't know how that hit me. Let's try that one again. Wait, hold on, I'm getting a phone call. Shit. I missed the call. Fuck. I didn't have my phone on me.
What is hitting me? What, what hit me? To sit through three stages of this shit. Oh my. Yep. I have any fucking idea. I don't know how I avoided that. Oh, thank fuck. Are you telling me that the screen pushed my character to, into the into the spike at the last second as the cutscene was starting? Is that that's hacks? That 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 is just that is just the game cheating. Can't say I fully understand her most of the time. Everything blah blah blah. It scares me. Yeah, I find myself so drawn to her. I can't help it. Please do not... Mm -hmm. Don't... Fuck, wait. Just eat all the berries, all of them. Every single one. Oh, thank fuck. Which one is it? This one? Okay, one more. Just, okay. If I get this question right, I'm done. Rosen Marine has been right about everything. I don't know why or how, but I've come to trust her. These past few days, I've truly come to believe in my fate, believe in my believe in her purpose. In our new beginning together. What you no, no 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 you are okay. Okay, there we go. What's this? Vessel Testament. A bottle? For your sweetest nectar, lass. Show yourself, you wretch. Nah, uh, you're truly so bewitching, lass. To think you're willing to betray such pure feelings. I need to get out of here. Oh, it makes me want to keep you all to myself. I must say, I feel much better, father. You were all a little too tense. I'm back in Kieferberg. 
Get some rest, everyone. We have a long day ahead of ourselves tomorrow. We're together here first thing at sunrise for the pr uh, for the procession. Don't forget. Whew. Come, Miss Odelia. We'll walk you home. Oh, thank you, my dear. What are you doing here? Did you go to the vi to the vigil? <laughs> have I been reading vigil wrong the whole time? I think I have. I was sitting right beside you the entire time, silly. What? More importantly, Elisa. I was wondering if you've given the gift some thought. Huh? Uh, yes. What about the gift, Rosa Marina? I was thinking, since we had the red wine during the vigil, why don't you do something similar for your gift to him? Meaning? Why didn't you use the water that's already in those basins? Together with that needle, you could make him the sweetest nectar. As a gift. I can't wait for you outside. And make certain nobody sees you. I best do it quickly. I wouldn't want to get caught by Father Hans. <sighs> what? Hmm. Using the water in the basin? I suppose I can give it a try. Wait a goddamn minute. Before you do that. Alright, let's see. I should... Wait, no? It's still not open? Rosa Marina said I could make him wine using the water in this basin. If only I had something to hold this wine in. Uh, you do. That's Serpent's Vial. I suppose it'll do nicely. Now, all I ought to do is... Make wine, or the sweetest nectar, I suppose. There's only one thing I can think of, but it sounds rather painful. How much money do I have? I have four. Let me... Let me see if I can sell something. I'm so tired of this. It's best I don't wander into town. Fuck! Don't fuck see me out this late at night. Never mind. I guess we're keeping this really fucking annoying... Hurry now, Elisa. Folks might come back if you take too long. What? Wait. 
Huh? Why is it red? Point of the sweet nectar, I suppose. There's only one thing I can think of, but it sounds rather painful. That's completely smooth. I have no idea. This silly old thing. The thing Lep Kuhin and I used to spend entire afternoons taking turns on this swing. Secured by slightly frayed rope and covered with pine needles, the swing's wooden plank sways gently in the breeze. So, have I done? No way. I'm getting closer and closer to meeting him, aren't I? Okay, never mind. Hold on. What am I supposed to do? Because there's nothing in there that I could interact with. Unless... Wait a goddamn second. Don't tell me it was like, obvious and I just completely overlooked it. Oh my god, it was. At last, lass. Don't you dare come any closer, serpent. The sweetest nectar, at last. And that's what I've come to do. And that's what I've come here to do. Your passion for your wish runs deep within your veins, lass. It's writhing inside you. It can it consumes you. What do you want from me? Your blood, lass. You wretch. Give it to me. Your sweetest nectar.
<laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Ah, I see. Ow. Round two. So am I supposed to use this? Yep. No! Uh, there we go. That wasn't too hard. The bill against the snake. We'll be waiting. We'll be awaiting you tomorrow, lass. I've had enough of this serpent. For goodness sake. All this for. The sweetest nectar. This thing, the sweetest nectar. I've made two gifts. But I'm still missing the good company, aren't I? Talking to yourself, lass? Is there something you'd like to tell me, Elisa? No, I was... It's best you move along, lass. It's late. I'll be on my way, father. Don't be late for the pro for the procession tomorrow. Where are we collecti collecting gifts again? Uh, because uh, that's the only way to meet him. Come now, Rose and Marine. We're going home. Uh, Elise, how did it... We can talk about it on the way. Let's go. Father Hans nearly caught me, Rose and Marine. Oh, but he didn't. No, you don't understand. You got the gift, didn't you? The sweetest nectar? I suppose I did, but... All that's left now is the good company. The good company, you say. I still don't understand what that is. Why, it's the object of your affections, Elisa. The object of my affections, you say? It's all about commitment, Elisa. Oh, I've had it with this commitment nonsense. I never want to hear that word ever again. You're so dramatic, Elisa. Oh, how I would love to be your good company. You are, I'm pretty sure. Alright, that's it. What, did I say something wrong? What is a good company, Rosa and Marina? Well, I'm certain you already know deep down. It's essentially a representation of your heart, Elisa. Do you know who the witch is? Or is it not revealed yet? Um... I... Th I think it's like... Either Rosa Marina's grandma or like someone who's really obsessed with Rosa Marina. Because it doesn't seem to be her, it just seems to be like whoever takes her appearance when you go into the woods. Which is like the old hag. I think that's that's who it is. Boy, I haven't really known much about her for the most part. I think it's her grandma. It's essentially a representation of your heart, Elisa. So we have the flesh, the blood, and the heart. I understand the meaning behind all that, but... So when you love, Elisa... Huh? You must show him you're committed by offering him your flesh and your blood and... by appearing before him in your most vulnerable state. You don't mean... 
The one you love most, Elisa. You must take them to him with you. Oh, how I would love to be a good company. Oh, I already read this one. I'm so tired. I'm so tired of this bullshit. Oh my god, stop whispering. I get it. I'm low on sanity, alright? Cool. I'm losing real life sanity here. Oh, I can't even interact anymore. We know we're basically there at this point. I think... I think after I go to bed, I think I'm gonna have to end the stream and start a new one. Because it's already been 11 hours 25. But also do save. Uh, the best experience is that way, I guess. It's annoying though. It's really annoying. And it's like... I don't think it's like... It's not supposed to be there it's just because i'm low on sanity because i've been doing like the side quest like the side thingy wait oh no, no, no. this 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 oh never mind still like that i was kind of expecting it i was kind of expecting it to change oh my god shut up 13 fireflies cool Oh. Tomorrow's the day. I might actually make it out of Kieferberg. I better get some sleep. Oh yeah, so I get to hear the song again. I'm here again. I keep having this dream. Oh my god. They're following me even in my dreams! The castle? It's so close now. If I do meet him, I bring him those gifts. And if he does grant my w grant me my wish, not only this castle, but everything and anything I could ever want, it will all be within my reach. It's getting further away. What is her wish? Uh, fortune. Which, to be fair, that's all of our wishes. That dream again. Didn't even get to hear the song. Best get up and head to town. I suppose we'll have that procession in the morning as usual, but... I'd like to spend some time with those in Marine later, too. Anyhow, I'd best get going to the festival. Okay, um... Oh my god, shut up. Okay, um... It's been an hour and 28 minutes. Uh, meaning that... After like another half hour... 
the stream is gonna the vod is gonna cut out so uh i'm gonna have to end this part here start part 67 uh later and like start part 67 uh in a minute once i'm done once once this stream is over uh and and i think i'll get i'll finally get an ending because jesus christ i have i haven't gotten a single ending yet this game is long as fuck which i'm kind of glad um but yeah so i'm gonna end this stream start a new one and then you know the drill all right